let's just let's just get started. Let's just go. It, do it doesn't matter. Hit button. There's buttons down below. I'm doing some mess. Hit some buttons. There's links in the description. Go find them. Uh, I'm here with Bone and Gargoyle. What's up, guys? Morning. Hi. Yes. All the excitement today. I love it. I woke um, up with six inches of snow. There is no excitement. Just disappointment. Dude, man. If I woke up with six inches of snow, it'd be Snowman City outside. And yeah, I know what you're thinking. That's only six inches of snow. How are you going to make a snowman? You've never seen Mississippi with snow. We make snowmen out of whatever amount of snow we get. Potato flakes. <laughs> I mean, basically, yeah, that's what we normally get. And we managed to build like a four foot tall snowman. It took the whole yard and half the neighbors, but we did it. <laughs> we made a snowman. Uh, so today we're working on the public square here in Chinatown uh, on construction sim. Why am I moving so slow? Did they, did they change the speed at which you run in the update? I have no idea what they changed with the update. Also, I mean, the you still have a sprint, right? I do, but in first person, it feels so slow. Also, the, the whatever they did to the graphics update, they tanked the FPS. My FPS is crap now. Yeah, normally I hold 60 FPS right now. I'm holding 45. I'm holding yeah, 60. I got 50. But, oh well. All right, so there was a big update for the game. We haven't, I haven't played since. I don't know if these guys have or not. Nope. Um, but there's lots of different things you can do now with your keybinds and your controls and, and uh, camera and all kind of stuff. So they added a bunch of stuff. Go look at it. It's all in the Steam page we play on computer. So go check that out. Uh, anyway, we're building the public square. What do we need first? We need stuff. Uh, let's go over to jobs. We'll check this out here. Uh, so, oh, it doesn't, it doesn't give me the rundown after I've accepted the job, huh? Oh, maybe it does. Maybe uh, if I go here. Yeah, yeah, yeah you, go, you go into the job, and then you can take a look at what you need. Disposal materials, delivery, unpacking. Well, no, no. I mean, like, the, the description or whatever. Like, that's what I was looking uh, for. Yeah, you have to go back to, like, the, the main, like, the urban space, and then go over to public square. Gotcha. So, Eastern Architecture, this part of the town, this part of town is more than just sightseeing attraction. It's also where lots of people live and work. Some needs, someone needs to give this landmark a new lease on life. So, that's what we're going to do today. We're going to be working on uh, this public square in Chinatown. So we're going to do the meeting. we got sewer works, which I'm guessing is uh, disposal, and then materials delivery, and then unpacking, and then component placement. So basically, we're going to be removing these pipes. Uh, and it's a lot yeah, of crane work, but I feel like... Oh, oh God, fell, fell down. You can okay. get out. Yeah. Uh, I feel like it's a lot of crane work, but also uh, the next job we're going to need... It's going to be a lot more detail. Yeah, dude, it's just so jerky now. What happened? What did they do to the game? Oh, man. Okay. Speak the mayor. Here we go. The Chinatown district is a tourist highlight and the place of residence for many people of Chinese origin. It upsets me to see that the vibrant hustle in the narrow alleyways has almost completely disappeared. Dilapidation and signs of neglect are everywhere. In recent times, unfortunately, there was never enough money to carry out important restoration work on the streetcars and main square. So many shop owners had to close for safety reasons. But now I finally got the approval for the means to bring the old glamour back to this district. So let's get started. Okay, let's get started. Hmm. I didn't get a... A uh, thing saying, "Oh, uh, cutscene started." Did you want to yeah, watch? Yeah, either did I. Did you not really? Weird. No. Wow. Okay. So they, I think they broke multiplayer. I guess. Um, Kim. So. Battery. So the. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. Um, I, I was about to ask. Do you, do you guys want to? Uh, Do a second side job or something while I do this and do all the crane work on it because I know this isn't going to take long or do you just want to rotate out and knock this out as quick as possible here let's knock it out is what I'm thinking okay cool yeah bone is already in the crane I think uh, we're removing pieces so that's yeah, good if, if you guys want to you'll need an excavator next uh, uh, for the, the digging excavator. part um, or if somebody wants to uh, just order the materials and get them here I can I can order materials. I can do that. Yeah, just get them all. All right, yeah, where's I'll the, get the equipment here? The material, building materials. There we go. 
Enter. Filter. All right. Uh, how's, how's everybody doing in live chat? Uh, Bob, Kim, uh, Gargoyle, Battery. Bone is here too, I'm sure. May not be watching. But he's playing, so he's in here. Oh, he is watching. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Even construction workers are getting tired of endless road projects. I saw them putting up a protest sign today that said, In construction. I like it. Yeah. I guess they like living with potholes. What do you mean? I thought no. that's what roads were supposed to be. Yeah, have you ever not seen a construction site? At the end of it, it always says, End construction. That is true. The joke is not funny if I got to explain it to you, you know? It's first thing in the morning for me. You know? uh, I haven't had my first hot chocolate I was, yet. I was sitting there thinking, I mean, it's end construction, like end construction, yeah. at the end of the road, end construction. Uh, all right, so all that's all right. delivered. It's all over there. Oh, dang. There's an excavator already there. Holy crap. Uh, so what do you need now? You got to put the pipes in? Yeah. Where are they at? Uh, you delivered them. The sewer Delivered component? Them. Oh, dang, they yeah. did. Okay, cool. I thought that was at the component store. What's up, Craven? How's it going? Getting ready for next week, so yeah, doing okay. Well, it's always good. Anyone preparing for food shortages next year? I mean, there's a there's a lake nearby. We have deer. I am no, you, you have, like, big dogs down there. That's all you have. You don't have deer. Well, yeah, we have, we have very large... Uh, four-legged animals, of some sort, with a white tail on it. So. They're just large animals. They're not uh, deer. Large dogs, probably the way to go. Yeah. Kim City, how are you? I mean, did I say hi to Kim? I don't know if I did. Hey, Kim City, how's it going? Um, so yeah, basically, uh, this job is just a lot of cramp. One person could probably knock this job out in what an hour. Yeah. Yeah, because I mean, once I do, I got two more things to move, and then it's digging the hole. Jesus. Watch the other buildings, man. No. Let's <laughs> hit pipe come flying by. <laughs> All right. That one's in. Place pallet of PVC pipes. Gargo, you running this rig or you want me to? Oh, you got the concrete I'll truck. I'll let you okay. go ahead and do that. I'm just grabbing all the equipment we're going to be needing. Okay. I don't know if we'll need oh. the pumper truck, bro. Dude, yeah, they broke the FPS in first person. I'm getting 21 FPS inside this thing. What in That's the no world? Good. Yeah, they broke it in the update, man. Oh, God. This is how, this is how a good game gets ruined right here. Also, my wheel my wheel and pedal does no, no longer works. Hey, what? Mine was. Yeah, well, I've got to go in and reset it, I guess, because it cleared all of my... Um, They did it to where you can do keybinds on it now, I think, so... No, no, they, they had keybinds before. The only thing that they added was keybinds to control. Unpack. Yep, going, going, going. Unpacking materials. Morning, Derek. Placing the PVC pipe. You doing it with that? Yeah. Okay. What's up, Derek? I mean, How's it going? I mean, you might be able to do it with the excavator, but... Maybe, but I'd rather have my... God. I mean, they just... Like, they defaulted it. the settings, yeah. It. It's, this is... Uh... Gamepad? What gamepad? My controller. Steam controller. Steam. Where? Where is my wheel and pedal? It's not even showed up. It's plugged in. And own. What in the world? Steam controller and Steam controller one. I don't know what that is. Before it said Logitech G29 and Logitech side panel on it. Like what? What is this? Uh, let me check mine. Mine, mine's working no problem so far. What? Oh, hold on here. This is, I mean, it, the update's great. I'm glad they did all the keybind stuff, but it seems they broke everything else. Gamepad, keyboard, Logitech, Stream G, 3D Pro, Logitech G27, gamepad. So yours says yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah that is on my end. 
That is strange, strange, strange. Strange. People are strange when they're strangers. Yeah, <laughs> I don't, uh, like my Steam, so Steam Controller and Steam Controller 1 all have the exact same inputs as the controller, as just the, the gamepad. Like, I don't know what's going on here. So basically my will and pedal is not going to work for anything today. Right. So get out of the marked area, Deuce. Yep. Give me a second. We'll just get rid of this. Because they refuse to fix things without breaking other things, apparently. So, don't need that today. That's good. Yeah, it's, it's fine. One less thing in my way. All right, now we dig. Dig a hole. Dig a hole. I got it. I got the I got the hole digging. I think. I'm just gonna stay in the crane for now, I guess. Was it plugged in before you started the game up? It was. It was, it was. Uh, it's not really a shocker that it's broke, though. Uh, they broke a lot of stuff in that update, so. Woo! You do have to dig down pretty, uh, okay. just so you know. Yep, we'll start right here at the top. Deep. Start at the I mean, top and go, go from there. Yeah, you gotta go all the way down to the sewer pipe, so. Well, no, I gotta be able to see it though. I can see just fine from up here. Well, yeah, but you're 150 <laughs> feet in the air though. Yeah. Oh god, dude, the FPS is this. This is awful. Uh, yeah, give me I the mean, give me the janky camera back. Give me my FPS back in first person. See, I don't know why you're having an issue because I'm running. I'm playing on 4K and I'm hitting 60 FPS. Are you in first person? Yeah, go to first person. Like I'm yeah, in first it, person, it, and I'm still at 60 FPS. You're not moving. You're literally sitting in a crane. <laughs> uh, well, I'm, I'm rotating the crane. Right uh, I'm not the only person to complain about that. Most of the Steam comments have been, you broke the first person FPS. So, yeah. uh, back up a little bit, Gargle. You bet. There we go. That oh. is an awesome oh. view from right here, though. Oh, dude, yeah. That is cool. Down the river? Yeah. Uh, okay. And just to keep things going, I'll just do the auto empty. That sounds good. Oh, what? What? Watching the boat now. What just that happened? That was weird. Yeah. Interesting. Oh. Uh, um, Love this just game. Just a curiosity for the uh, FPS issues. Did you uh, download the new NVIDIA driver? Uh, I there tried was, to. Okay, there was a new NVIDIA driver, and this game is now in it. I bet that's it, yeah, then. I got, the, I got the new NVIDIA driver, was it two days ago? Yeah, I bet that's yeah. it. And I'm still having the same issues due to the first person. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Well, normally well, I would I would chalk it up to that, because normally that's what it is. So. And the crane is beautiful, I don't know. <laughs> Your keyboard's in French, bub. Or bud. Morning. What's up, bud? How's it going? Oh, yeah, it is, isn't it? <laughs> Morning, Karsten. Actually, I guess good evening. Yeah, good evening. Oh, man. So, so bad. Like, it's just so bad. Yeah, in my screen, you're hitting the the dumper no problem and yet it's pouring out the sides <laughs> really well it's making this like waterfall effect of dirt it's so strange yeah, yeah. spikes up really high and then you know falls into the truck hey go ahead and empty it uh yeah okay. there you go Thirty seventy is really good, Craven. Y'all hear that uh, EVGA pulled out from Nvidia? 
Yep, did away with the partnership. Yep. Got away from it. I would too with the way that uh, NVIDIA was doing things. Dirty pool. Dirty, dirty, dirty pool. Fine, uh, NVIDIA still would be king. Oh, yeah. They're not going anywhere. Dirt waterfalls. You gotta love that. I'm just slowly getting higher and higher in the world. <laughs> Don't go chasing waterfalls. Have I ever played the infected? Uh, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. I think a while I'm, ago, but yeah. That was a it. long time ago, yeah. Speaking of uh, those types of games, how's the subsistence going? Have they done any updates lately? Um, there have been some updates. I just haven't gone back and played it. I've never played it, Bob. So you can't say we we all have played it. I haven't played it. How in the world are you up on the side? Like, what is what is this? I'm I'm a, I'm a floating in the air at the moment. <laughs> How is that possible? Well, just for some reason, the dirt piled up underneath me and I just got higher and higher and higher. That's fine. Yeah, in my screen, my wheels aren't even touching the ground. No, they're not. <laughs> it, they, they broke something in this update, dude. Like, oh, yeah. Man. I was all excited too. I was like, oh, camera fixes and all kinds of stuff. Cool. Keybinds. 14 FPS in cap. Terrible. <clears throat> Terrible. Yeah, it got to the point where I was like, I hacked with it and I just went back to third person. Yeah, it's, it's easier to dig in first person for me though. Yeah, yeah. I will admit that it is nicer in the in cab for excavating. It's one of the few vehicles that it's actually easier to do, other than maybe the rolling. Some of the vehicles, it's almost impossible to drive in first person. It does get difficult, okay. some of them, yeah. Because they just they put the exhaust stack right in your field of view. Well, I'll say this. Uh, I could blame this on NVIDIA drivers. But I know that they just did a complete overhaul of their graphics and keybinds and camera controls and everything else in the game. I'm going to lean toward more it's the game. I've had NVIDIA driver updates and uh, impact my, my gameplay before, but not to this extent. Like, the last time we did this, I was running 60 FPS in cap. So. No, there's no reason why I should be at 30 frames per second because you're loading dirt on me. Right. Like, well, that's what I'm saying. It, it's like, this it is... It. Yeah. There's something something that happened on their end. But hopefully they fix it. Hopefully they fix it. It's just a... I'm sure there'll be another patch or something. Yeah, just a weird experience until they do, I guess. Yeah, do you think that they would have caught that in testing? You know what I mean? You would, you would think so, but... Uh, hey, man. I, I would turn on my lights, but I don't have any. They, they're, they're, they're doing stuff, right? I mean, they're working on things. So. Yeah. I can't yeah, control the though. No reason to stay mad about it or anything. Yeah, it's their reputation, not ours, right? That's true. That's true. So what's yeah, I mean, weird, I'm... though, is this... It feels like Gold Rush. Yep. This is what this feels like. This is Gold Rush right when Gold Rush came out. The in-cab digging. It's, it's just as... Like, awkward now. The... So. 97... 96... Just come up and fell back in there. What? Uh, yeah, you I, go I, too I saw deep. it go up and then yeah. go back down. Yeah. yeah, you can't go too deep there. Yeah, I think it's just the wall coming down. When the wall comes tumbling down, there we go. Ninety-nine percent. 
And... 100. 100. Yeah, I'll clear the marked area when I get good and ready. Yeah, really, just keep on digging dirt. What is, what is happening here? I mean, you're not making much money, but still, you're making money. Okay. Clear the marked area. All right. I got a fast travel. Oh, I hate that when you get too many pieces of equipment. This guy can throw all of it before you can get to the... There we go. Unpack me. Yep. Working on it. Trying to get this thing to... Oh my god, what is happening? Oh, I'm hitting the dump truck. I mean, the cement truck. I was wondering, I was like, what is happening? I can't turn. <laughs> Use your mirrors in that first person. Uh, where'd they go? Oh, over there. Now, why'd they move that's over there? Where, that's... Yeah, that's not where you unpacked them. It's weird. <laughs> Grab the uh, third one, don't leave me the other okay, one. Are you gonna try to grab one? Yeah, I'm gonna try this. See how it works. Okay. Uh, I mean, you should be able to reach down there. Should be able to. Find I mean, out. Closer, a little bit to left. There you go. <laughs> Man, <laughs> just went to turn green for me. Haha, <laughs> 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 you gotta clear the area. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> now I gotta get out of here. Come on, man. Yeah, the out of cab. I'm still like, I'm still lost frames, but it's not as bad. Like, all right. I mean, you can help with this too if you want. Uh, yeah, let me get out of the way here so you can place everything and we'll see where it goes. Why not? No, I mean, you could help uh, grab it with, uh, with the excavator. Oh, you think so? I mean, I think that would take longer, probably. I got seven things to grab. Oh. Oh, I thought it was only two. Now we got, like, actually quite a bit. Oh. Okay. Six, seven. Yeah, good counting, bud. All right, don't bow. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Brain unfunked. three plus three plus one it's not it's not that hard but yeah i know it's still early for you yeah i still haven't finished my hot chocolate yet uh you can unpack it when it's coming down all right uh, moving to grab the rebar you don't need the rebar oh well it had a thing above it well they all do <laughs> Well, here, you can take that back over there, then. I don't want it. All right, what do I need, then? I need other ones. Green ones. Yeah, we need three of the big green ones and three of the white sacks. Okay. Pretty sure I wouldn't just be slinging this around with no care in the world, but, uh, hey, whatever. Well, I am. Oh, wrong way. Oh, dang, you already got uh, some concrete going in over here. Okay. Off we go. Off we go. Has it been dark the whole stream so far? I think it has. No, we oh, went through uh, one daylight it, cycle. It, 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 yeah, it's, we started in the day, but it didn't last long. Moving stuff around with this. Hey, you're s you're slower, but you're still helping. I mean, if it keeps you from like, if you can get two to my one, that's still pretty good. That saves the last right. trip, right? Oh yeah. All right, you need uh, what three, three, two more of these? Whoa! There's a, gar there's a gargoyle coming at me. Well, he was pouring concrete. Yeah. 
That's why I did the rebar first. That way it gives him something to do. I like twiddling my thumbs. I right? there's a little bit of Jackson in me this morning. Well, hopefully in about two weeks, there's uh, going to be a Jackson and everybody. Yeah, that'd be good. Oh, come on. 97%. Really? You, uh, when's, when's the release? Have you, have you said the release date for that yet? November 7th, I do believe is the release date. Yeah. So about two weeks. Cool, man. Uh, so if you guys don't know, Bone, it writes, uh, what do, what do you call it, sir? Is the, hey! Audio dramas. Woo! Audio dramas. Um... And his second season of A Walk With Ghost starts November 7th. You can find his channel down below for YouTube or, uh, what is it, A Walk With Ghost on all uh, podcast platforms? Yep. Spotify, Amazon, Podcast Addicts, Google Podcasts, all that. That's everywhere. Cool. Well, there you go. Uh, also, if you like other games as well, uh, Gargoyle's link is down below too. Okay. All right, unpack. I'm trying to stop the construction vehicle. You have to stop the construction vehicle before you can get out. Yes, I know that. I was trying to stop. Uh, you don't have to, but. All right. This is red where Bruce Willis steps out of the car when it's in that slide or whatever it is, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's a great action slide right there, too. Yeah, that was good. Well, see, Bob, that's perfect timing, then. Yeah. I mean, not for you, but, I mean, you'll have something to listen to. Look out! Well, I'd be holding on the guide wire on that one. <laughs> Go for a ride. Woo Catch a ride. <laughs> Did somebody sue Dobrik over something like that? Or was that no? That was an excavator swing or something like that, wasn't it? Oh, I don't know. Uh, I do know there's a new Tales from Borderlands up. Is there? Yeah. I saw oh, it on the Steam it. News and restarted my Steam today. Oh, Come on, man. I'm trying to get up my here. Steam in like a week. Can't climb on top of this stuff anymore. So, is it a, a DLC to Borderlands 3 or. No, no. Tales from the Borderlands was the Telltale oh, Games. Uh, Tales from the Borderlands. There's a new one out. Yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, um, that was the Telltale Games, like the. Uh, yeah, has um, a walk with, um, not a walk with, um, where is it? No. What's the one with the wolf? Gargoyle on packet? Uh, yeah, Wolf Among Us. Uh, wolf Among yeah. Us Season 2 is not out yet, no. no. Okay, that's the one I'm waiting for. Yeah, me too. That was great. I probably will not no, be making yeah. any content on it. That's that's going to be one for me that I enjoy. Uh, yeah, well, I, I mean, it's not like it's PG uh, stuff, so. Uh, at this point, I don't care. If I wanted to stream that one, I was still streaming. It's such a great, great series. Great storytelling. Uh, what? Am I still in the marked area? What is this? Because there's, um, that's where the sign's going. Well, I'm trying to move. It won't let me back up anymore. Oh. Um, there's a, a post behind you. Yeah. Yep. There's a bit of a pillar in the middle of here. Yeah. That's where the posts have to go. Okay, we'll just go out here then. Oh, hey, I can I can help. Yep. Um, you can put the post up. You won't be able to put the sign up though. Yeah. Hey, uh, I don't I don't think you can get uh, that high. I don't think he gets the height. Yeah. Oh no, not for the sign. Definitely, I may not get high enough for the post. Uh, remember, right. uh, you have a small one that goes on the uh, that goes on the end. That won't turn green for you there. No, we're so close. 
Ah, uh, well, I'm glad I brought the bumper. You can get up there. No, you can't. I just tried. Yeah, you, no, you can. <laughs> Bones like I've done this before. Uh huh. I've done this before. <laughs> you can do it. You gotta hit it at the. You, you gotta hit it on an angle, and you have to be going forward. Oh, okay. You, you don't get enough speed going in reverse. We didn't need that front suspension anyway. Uh, stop! <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. You gotta hit the brake just right, or else you're gonna go right over it. But see, you were able to get up there, weren't you? Yeah. Uh -huh. I just had to curse at it and hold my tongue the right way. Is Telltale back? Telltale's not, no, but somebody else picked up a lot of their... Um, yeah, someone their, bought them yeah. out. The franchise yeah. stuff. Yeah, so... Yeah, about uh, the rights. A wolf, a, uh, a wolf Among Us was the thing that was like, they were almost done with it when Telltale closed up. So that's the like the main thing that I think a lot of people were waiting on. Yeah. I was waiting. That's what I was waiting on. Um, fantastic I mean, I series. I didn't mind the Walking Dead ones. Um, they got kind of repeaty though, but I did enjoy the story. They did... They did kind of, yeah. I never play, so I played uh, episode one and two, I think. So that's okay, as far as yeah, I made it because I was kind of burnt out on zombie stuff at that point. Like I was just yeah. like, I don't care anymore. I mean, I think they hit it at the right time. Yeah, Tales from the Borderlands was great, man. It was yes, that was fantastic, it was funny man. too. It was, yeah, and that's and and that's the one thing too. I'm glad they kept that that Borderlands humor, and yep. then they built it into the characters or whatever. I mean, believe it or not, I actually played Tales from the Borderland before I ever played a Borderland game. Oh, really? And that oh. made me want to play a Borderland game. Oh, well, that's cool. Wow. Yeah, because Tales from the Borderlands happened between two and two and uh, three. Right? Three, I think, or the prequel. That happened between two and the, the prequel. prequel. Right. Yep. Yeah. The only one I didn't like of the Borderlands, and I can't remember what name it was, was the one where you the gravity is all messed up and everything. You're like on a moon or something stupid. Yeah, that's the prequel. Yeah, yeah. the I did prequel not like did that one. not go well for a lot of people. I mean, I I enjoyed it, but it was de definitely not my favorite one. Two was really good. Um, I mean, one was good to you know to get as an intro. Um. I don't know about three though. I haven't. I haven't played three. Uh, I think I own it, and I've played about ten minutes of it. <laughs> I don't think I've played I've it. I finished them all, and yeah, so far, the third one isn't that bad. Actually, I quite enjoyed it. Good story. See, like I said, Deuce mostly Kramer. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just a lot of that, isn't it? Yeah. What's up, Tia? How's it going? Morning, Tia. Yeah, I don't think I can reach high enough to put those up there. So. No, you could do this one, though. These? Yeah. Think so? I don't know. By the time I got the excavator over here, you'd be done. Also, it does say we need the crane truck too. But it does it does say the crane truck, so the crane truck is for uh delivery though, isn't it? Mostly? I don't know. I mean, because it's got the delivery truck on there for deliveries, and it's got the crane truck separate, but only once. So I don't I mean, know what you would you, use it for. I guess this be, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, you, you could use it for this. I mean it's how we did the other pavilion, right? Right. Like we're out of material, right? Like what's left now? The next thing is building this and then I think a road. Oh, that's yeah. right. That's right. I forgot about the road. Yeah. Still got the road to do. Do you want to buy one of them their uh, road rippers? Do we not own one? I thought we owned one. Uh, not that I'm seeing. The road mill. Oh, I guess we don't know. We got the other stuff for the paving. 
Yep. I will. I will go. Uh, let's see to the map, and then we'll go here. Then we'll enter. We'll buy one of them there. Road rippers. Cold planer. What it is. Uh, what do we have now? Do we have bow mag stuff? Or we have caterpillar stuff. Uh, I've always gone with cat because cat holds the most, usually. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with that. I went with the white one, whatever the white one is. Uh, that would be that a, a, one. a a vertkin. Yeah. I think we'll go with the caterpillar. Wait, I I can find it again now. Old planer. Got it. Because I don't know if size really matters on something like that. No. No, probably not. I mean, as long as it moves forward and rips up the pavement. That's pretty much it, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's not like it's a special vehicle. I thought for sure they were going to have that at one contact point right at the top there. Nope, they did it the right way. <laughs> it's, it's on the corners. All right, I'm done with the green. Clear the mark. Oh, I'm in the marked area. Oh, it's just easier for you to do it because if I do it, you have to accept it anyways. If I'm standing there, it's easier, yeah. Okay. All right, what do you want to drive? Uh, actually, you want the... It looks like Gargoyle's in the dump truck. Okay. Where Where is the the coal planer at? Oh, it's at the store right here. I'll go grab it. Yeah, might as well do that, and then I'll jump on the paper, I guess. I don't know why you parked them all down here. <laughs> the furthest away you could get them. Huh? <laughs> yeah, we have to drive them there. Uh... I'll park and them way down it, here. It doesn't show me any of the markings for where it was supposed to be, and all I did was just go back around, up 10 go feet. Go around the block. The... Go around the block. Oh, gotcha. There's a blue and dot that's... there. What's up to you? Not on my screen. But, uh -huh. Yeah, it will be. Oh, there we go. Now it popped. Hey, this yeah, is a tracked vehicle. Yeah. But, but it doesn't take... Um, it, you only use one, one trigger to drive it, though, on the controller. The other ones you use like your left your left one is your your left trigger uh, is the left the track. It was previously, so that's part of the update. Oh, fixing Before this to be, be just like the excavator. Yeah. yeah, no, this this drives like a truck now. Right trigger is your gas, left trigger is your brake. I'll let you go in front of me. Or maybe it's because it has steering. It all 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 track steer. Maybe that's why. On the cold planer, I don't know. What's up, Franklin? I mean, uh, Vincent, how's it going? More than likely, yes, that's probably true, because, yeah, uh, all, all four tracks turn. Yeah, so that's, that's probably what it is. Yeah, that's probably why it does it. I've just never, I've never driven this, I don't think. Never done anything with it, so. Yeah, we haven't done a job where we had to rip up pavement. I'm, I'm, I'm making my way downtown. I'm coming. Making my way I knew downtown. it. I knew it was sticking somebody's head. And that's going to be there for a while, too. Good luck. That's all right. It's a, it's a halfway decent time. Now, the issue that I'm having here, Deuce, is that you got to go in backwards because this truck does not drive forward. Uh, it hits the guardrails. Wait, what? It is a tight area. Yeah, very tight. Yeah. Oh, we're going right there. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, when you yeah. go in, just go backwards. It's Friday. It's Friday. That's a terrible song. Hey, guess what, Bone? God. There's a white dot marker now. I got. I can see a white dot marker on that mill plane. Oh, you can, dude. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. That wasn't okay, there so before. Okay, so that's good. Yeah, that, that's a nice improvement. All right, how does this yeah, thing work? You, you have to guess where you were going. So the, there is no like extension on this or anything. Like the milling is just the width, right? That's it. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yep. Just the width, and you can swing the uh, the conveyor yeah, left and right. Oh, you can. Yep. yep. Uh, left bumper and right bumper. Uh, nope. Nope. N not triggers, bumpers. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There okay. Go. All right. Cool. Yeah, get back as far as you can. I am. Okay. And then go forward. 
That is pretty sweet. You are going to have to go in frontwards to get the, the end strip, so. That's all right. I have Gargoyle pull around to the other side. Or we just won't worry about it. Um, I mean, if you can get to the hundred, that's fine. Yes, yeah, so we just won't worry about keeping the extra or whatever. Let's stay straight here. Hey, Euphoria, how's it going? Welcome. Yeah, I think once you guys get like halfway done, I can finally get something going. Now that's pretty cool right there. And you'll make quite a bit of money selling this too. Yes, this is one of the best things to sell. The asphalt? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I'll make around 18k off a load from the dump truck. Oh dang. Yeah, versus 3,000 for the dirt. Yeah, it's an easy way to make uh, some Hang on. some decent amount of money. I'll get over just a bit here. I'm in first person. I want to see what this looks like in first person. <laughs> I don't know how much you can really see in first person on that. You ready? Mm-hmm. I mean, I can see enough, I guess, but kind of neat. It looks like just your rear needs uh, has room there, Garbo. Uh, I'm at 99%, so. Oh, okay. Hey, 13, 10 grand. Two. What? It's at 13.2 on my screen when I went to empty it, and it only gave us like 10.740. Yeah. That's weird. He might not have the all the Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But he Perfect. should. I mean, we've been doing enough on his save file, so his, yeah. he should have it. Uh, can I, I get in there yet? Uh, you might. Yeah, you should be able to. All right, here we go. I just want to spread. Oh, I hit the ball. There we go. I don't know, does it let you do that, or is it, does it do one of those things where it, uh, like it finishes it after you get finished with it or something? Like how does that work? What? The milling process. Is it, oh, you're already spreading. Okay, cool. I don't know if it lets you do that or not. So I do have yeah. a hump right there between us, Bone. So you may have to wait on me to get that. I don't know. All right, hang on. Let me get, uh, let me move again. over a bit here. Trying to find the edge of the concrete. It was so dark a minute ago, I couldn't see what I was hitting there. So yeah, the shadows. Yeah. All right, here we go. Pulling me off the road there. Yeah, it does that when you catch the side of the the asphalt. You get one side, one one tire crack, whatever drops. Yeah, I think you're going to have to get the one in. Yeah, where are we at? 94. I got a little bit right here. I don't know if it's going to be enough or not, but... Yeah, I, I doubt it's 6%. Probably not. It's pretty doggone close, wasn't it? All right, let me grab the end down there then. Yeah, I can't fit in there, so I'll just empty this out and get rid of it. Yeah, go grab the compactor. Yep. Uh, you want to pull the truck around to the other end? It won't fit. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah. No, no, I mean, up on the... You can only swing the conveyor just so far, that's all. Yeah, up on the, on the construction site where we just were. Invisible wall. 
Oh, is there? Okay. Yeah, that's what I was saying. That yeah, I'm gonna have to go the way that we did because I just couldn't get in there. Yeah, I'm trying to turn here, but I'm having difficulties. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see what they did. Okay. So basically, we're just gonna drop the stuff on yeah. the ground, let it go. Okay. We got enough out of it. I think that's fine. Oh yeah. All right, here we go. Morning, Euphoria. Yeah, this is a pretty tight space here. All right, there we go. All right, I'm out of the way. Would you just reset? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was just easier. <laughs> Let's get out of the oh, way. Oh yeah. Asphalting, ninety percent done. Oh, compact. Yeah. I see they haven't fixed the uh, the compactor for the asphalt. So when you jump into the asphalt uh, compactor from a uh, like a quick jump in type deal, like you bounce from one vehicle to the next, you get a maximum speed of like six kilometers an hour. However, if you turn the compactor on and try to drive, it'll turn it off, it'll disable it, and then you can drive 11 kilometers an hour. Weird. Yep. Very strange. Yeah, I think it was Spanky told me that one. Come on, turn, baby, turn. Very tight space down here, huh? You better hit the brakes there. I'm coming forward. You better watch where I'm driving. There we go. And I'm just resetting. It's easier. If you ain't watching where I'm driving, who is? I would recommend watching, looking at this area at nighttime. So. Oh, is it good? Bunch of lights and stuff. Very cool stuff. Yeah. yeah good scenery. Yeah. I've always loved this kind of architecture, man. The Asian architecture. The, yeah. This. This. Um. Whatever. Whatever region it's from. Yeah. I mean, I have a general idea. Yes, but I mean, like specifically, I don't know if it's different in some regions of different Asian countries or whatever, so. Oh, you have the bow mag. I was wondering, like, why the heck is the front not working right? Because the front's only drive tires with the bow mag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Dude, the steam coming off that's kind of cool, though. Mm-hmm. Oh, off the roller? Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Well, that's what it should be. I think it's usually water jets that are running on the rear wheel. Pretty helps dang cool. Wheel, it helps keep the wheel clean and yeah. yeah, prevents it from sticking and ripping yeah. up the asphalt that you're putting down. Pretty neat. I'll have one of those in my driveway in uh, on Monday. Oh, oh dang! You getting it paved? Um, I'm using recycled. Nice. Even so. still, I mean that's better than always having to you know every two years having to lay down gravel. I could get my gravel to last about eight, but... Oh, wow. You don't have um, heavy equipment. <laughs> well, I mean, it's constant maintenance on it, you know? Hmm. Spreading it, and, um, going back over it, and stuff like that. So I'm just like, eh, forget about it. Yeah. All the tractors and everything on the farm, we always had to do it every two years. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got stuff like that coming in. So um, uh, when we did Elm Creek 2022, or 22, whatever, on Farm Sim 22... Uh, I made a gravel pile in kind of in the middle of the place where the loop around is. Because um, mm -hmm. growing up, I remember we always had a gravel pile kind of right out to the, yep. uh, kind of to the, the back. The road, yep. Yeah, and because uh, we had 18 wheelers in and out of there constantly. So like yep. twice a oh, year, my dad be out there. And yeah. You were getting heaves. <laughs> yeah, man. Like every, every uh, I don't know, every six months or so, my, my dad be out there grading gravel again, <laughs> putting it back yeah, down. The harvest was always brutal for us going over it with the weight that the, the grain trucks. Oh, it just spreads it all over. Yeah. Oh, it just it just pounds the heck out of the road. You just get these ruts. They're just brutal. Like, there's no telling how much, how many layers of gravel are in that driveway. Oh. Uh, Fifteen years worth, twice a year, brand new gravel being spread out and <laughs> compressed down into the ground again. Mm -hmm. well, it's amazing how much the ground swallows it up. You know what I mean? Like, it's just 
Oh yeah. Takes it and disappears it. Yeah, he would always yeah. he would always get those the big um, the big chunks, uh, the big gravel yep. crushed rock. Yeah, yep. crushed rock. Yeah, that's what he'd always get. Yeah, there we go. There you rock. Yeah. Done. Clear the area, and then go talk to the to the guy, the mayor. Oh, let's get out of first person here. Feels like I'm going faster when I'm not in first person. I guess. Clear the construction site. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Speak with the mayor. Bone, do you want to do it and see if we get it, or...? I'll try. Yeah. Hey. I go. got it this time. Yeah, that's weird. Here. Finally, there is life here again. Soon, visitors will come to admire the unique architecture and charm of this place. The first shop owners have already reopened their stores, full of joy about the freshly renovated forecourt. I have always been fascinated with the unique entrance portals with their ornaments, which are real eye catchers, especially at night. Uh huh, uh huh, he even said it. Yep. Especially at night. All right, job completed. Yeah, I mean, at least it's architecture. Right, it's not just yeah. some buildings. Like, I mean, it looks nice. It does. It looks great. I was gonna say, I like the architecture. Is something great. finished at night and it's daytime. Dang it! <laughs> right. Yeah, I see the lanterns all and all that are lit. Yeah, all the lanterns will be lit, um, and there is a block behind it too. If you uh, come through what we just did and go in between the buildings here, there's all all these lanterns. Oh, there we go. Are, yep. Yeah, there we go. Lanterns. All these lanterns nice. lit up too. Yeah, come back, come back one block toward yep. me, and you'll see all the lanterns. Oh wow! It's really nice. Dang, they did a good job on this. Well, let's see all the lanterns hanging over that paved area we just put in. Did it? Yeah, very cool. Sorry. I saw the light. It's easy. <laughs> I was in camera mode. Yeah, uh, go, it looks go, awesome go though. Go to where we were, Deuce, and then go back on the night mode. Right here. No, yeah, over in here. Yep. Oh, oh, dude, yeah, there's a bunch hanging over here. Cool. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah. Looks real good. Yeah, you can only go so far with the... Oh, look at all this. Yeah, dude, this is great. All right, let's go back to camera mode. Uh, oh, this... I hate these pallet furnitures. Ugh. Okay. Oh, no, what? What happened? You got out of it or something, or what? I didn't mean to. I was just moving the camera around. Try it again. Okay, how do you, uh, go down here. Up we go. Oh, look at that. That's fantastic right there, man. This looks good. Oh, there's a hammer right over there. Just, uh, who's got the orange hat? I do. Yeah, it's behind you. Behind me? Yeah, look, turn oh, and look behind it. that little tree over there. I see it. Yeah. Wow, I missed it. That is no, awesome I didn't right see there. It at all. Okay, cool. Yep, get your hammer. That's number 29 for me. 27 for me. 23 for me. Yeah, Alright. I, I do not like the pallet furniture. They could have done anything but what the pallet furniture. Yeah. Yeah, I mean... Oh, my way. Like, I've seen I some mean, really nice pallet furniture, but, like, that's the cheap pallets that if you leave out in, like, a heavy dew, they start to fall apart. Yeah, well, and they go you, moldy. If you come and... over to the restaurant that's right next door to it where Gargoyle and I are at, I mean, you look at these tables and chairs, these are nice. Exactly. That's, like, that's the way where they actually take the pallets apart, you know, and refinish the and wood. And it re together, reclaimed, yeah. 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 Yeah, that's, like that, that, see, that's nice, yeah. yeah. I like the hedges, too, for the separation. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's nice, man. This is good. I like this. Yeah, the amount of uh, the amount of of like detail into the decor in this game is really nice. All right, cool. We calling it there. We doing another job. Uh, well, how long we we've, we've been live? Less than an hour. Yeah, let's do another job. Campaign. So, job or campaign? All right. uh, campaign because we've only got two left. We have to shop them all in the park, so on yeah. the on the urban space. Uh, shopping spree, 
shopping mall. In order to boost local economy, a new shopping mall has been talked about for quite some time. Now, the building complex with enough space for many stores is finally to be built. Okay. Job scope high. Okay, we got meeting. We got topsoil removal. We got excavation. Materials delivery. Prefabbed. Strip. Um, strip foundation. I'm guessing that's the uh, footings, probably. Gravel yeah. delivery. Compaction. Slab foundation. Some more concrete. Lots of concrete work this time. Uh, beams. Material delivery. Uh, I don't. I don't know what that word is. Concrete walls. Got to do those. Unpacking. Uh, support pillars. Ceiling cement panels. More unpacking. Prefab walls. There's a lot of crane work in this one too. In there. Uh, and, yeah, it's crane simulator. Yeah. Uh, wood components. Materials delivery. More unpacking. Timber floor. Yeah. This, this is going to be. So we'll bring the. Let's get the crane truck down here too. That way we can have two things swinging stuff around. At least. All right. Accept contract. Job scope high. $1.2 million. All right. Cool. Uh, let's see where it's at now. Right over there. Fast travel. What the? Oh. Why is fast travel? I was hitting A. Whoops. All right. Well, Gargo's already here with the bulldozer. Yep. Uh, do we want to do the thing where we get both bulldozers down here? Might as well. It looks fairly sizable. We got to talk to the, the mayor first. And then yep, we'll find go ahead. Talk to him. The locals have wanted a shopping mall here for a long time. Being able to take care of bulk shopping centrally without having to drive all over town might also help reduce the high emission levels. In addition, residents should feel more at home in their district. I want to show them that the city won't spare any expense in rapidly implementing even major projects. Shopping malls don't just offer places to shop, they also create new jobs. The construction plans have already been greenlighted, and I can't imagine a better company for this big job than yours. Well, okay then. I'm glad we've got a reputation. Yeah. Uh, this is quite the air, isn't it? Yeah, it's fair size. Yeah, let's go grab the other, the other dozer. Uh, do, we have, do we have two or just yep. three? Uh, I think we have three. I know we got yeah, one, two one, one's angles. The big one, right? Yeah. Grab one the, I'll grab the big one. That way, I'll, I'll I'll take the metal. Okay. And then you guys can be on the ends of me. Yeah, that sounds good. Put bone right in the middle, and then we'll get on either side of him and push and try to push everything off to the side. Sounds like a plan, boss. Shaking that bush, boss. Shaking that bush. Man, it'd be nice to have the wheel right now. I know that. Jeez. Yeah, I don't know why it wasn't working. I may, I may turn it back on in a minute. See if I can get it to work. Unplug it. Plug it back in. See if it registers it. Yeah, maybe that's all it needed. I don't know. Maybe I need to restart my Logitech software too, though. Probably several, several things that probably need to happen. Like squeeze behind you guys. Yeah, look at this. This is a, this is how you do it right here. Army of dozers. I mean, you could get the bucket loader out here too. Uh, hello? I need I need to turn. Jesus. There we go. No, 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 no. Camera, what are you doing? Don't be stupid again. Okay. You go ahead, Bone. That's loud. A lot of dirt moving going on. Still at 0% though. That's because it's all getting pushed back on here. Yeah. I'm done and I, we got the one. Oh, now it's down to zero again. Don't turn right there. I'm coming at you. There you go. 
Oh, at least they made it so the dozers could actually climb out of that. All right, redo the same path. Yeah, because we have big mounds here. That's, that's why. Yep. Who's late? What's up, Celtic Moon? Uh, I was late this morning, actually. So we actually you got started late. late. You always get here right when you're when you're supposed to get here. That's right. We scheduled to be here on our, our own time. Yep. Yeah. All right, just I should have two mounds coming off of me. So, yep. Gargle, change yours to the other way. Push it to the outside. Yeah, there you go. That should be clearing some off. That's what I was doing originally, but then it was like, hmm, my bone can get the, the meat and potatoes of it because it's got the big heavy rig. Once it gets over my blade, I'm done. That's the problem. Are you trying to race me in reverse here or what? Well, no, I had to move and it threw off the track, so. Oh. All right, 16% done. Do the same thing again down here. Yeah. I'm just shifting over a little bit. I'm going down your track pretty much. That's fine, yeah, I'll come back and go beside you again. Whatever, whatever needs to happen there. I'm gonna go on the right side of your track there and just keep pushing to the side. Yep. Gargle, if you're going to do that little area, go the opposite direction. That way you're pushing our dirt that we're making piles of. I'm moving all the dirt out of that section as it's going pretty good. So. I've this, done this before. Yeah, you're making progress. That's for dang sure. I've done this before. Not this particular level, but the actual dozer work many times. And out the end. Yeehaw. Yeah, look at the wall next to you. What wall? I don't see anything. <laughs> Huge <laughs> in my screen. <laughs> oh. Get out of my way. Yeah, that's a that's a wall. <laughs> I'm going, I'm going. I mean, but nice. we're moving it. Once we get that to the edge, it's gonna it's gonna complete a lot, because that's pretty much all the dirt right there. Right. Yeah, it's gonna move a lot. I'm not real sure I'm going to be able to move that, honestly. But it looks like it's moving it, so... I mean, it should. It is a dozer. It is. Uh, but we know this game. Yeah. It is a small dozer, though.
Oh, sorry, Gorgo. <laughs> I didn't okay. see you. I didn't see you back there. Sorry, Bone. Don't mind me. I'm just trying to figure out how to turn. I'm surprised though. Your little dozer can push me. Yeah, physics aren't I'm perfect in the game. I mean, my dozer's only twice the size of yours. Yeah, physics aren't perfect, but they're pretty good. Alright, we got one more push there probably on the side. Yeah. I'm on it. Well I was gonna I was gonna push it on off to the side, but alright. Take it, sir. I'll come behind you with if we need cleanup. Oh, it's gonna be cleanup you. I have no idea That's where the yellow pass. line is. Yeah, we're doing second pass. Yeah, you're you're right on the yellow line there, Bone. Let you have it. One more push on this side here. Like I can, I can see the the stakes on one side, but the other side they're they're still in the dirt. So I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna push one more time on the side here just to make sure we got it all out. Yeah, these uh, these the case dozers with the blade that twist is, is probably the best option for this. Yep. Eighty-five percent. I was moving. Sorry, I was trying to get out of your way. Yeah, who's got the right away? Those are derby. Oh, that'd, that'd be interesting. Be interesting to watch. Yeah. <laughs> It'd take a while. It would definitely take a while. It's not like you're getting in a high speed accident, so. Not only that, but the damage would be uh, minimal. Oh. <laughs> Here, I'm trying to drive away from you. <laughs> yeah, the damage would be very minimal. You would think. I mean, I don't know. You could probably mess up some tracks pretty quick. Build me a BMX ramp over here. Yeah. It's nice that we actually have some good traction now. Yeah, I'm glad they fixed that. Like before, you just get stuck on like a little dirt pile. Now I can I climbed over the whole end down here that time.
I'm, I'm happy for some of the fixes. I'm just really sad that the, the graphics are kind of broken. Yeah. But I can now use all the different controllers at, at the same time. Instead of just one at, instead of, yeah, instead of one at a time. Yeah, that's... I'm in, I'm in cabin. I'm still getting 60. I don't know. I mean, maybe it is the NVIDIA update, but I've seen lots and lots of comments on Steam about the first-person FPS. So, oh, I, I have don't the know. NVIDIA update, and it's still garbage. I have to get rid of it. Right. I have to go into third-person. And that should be it, like... Oh, there's still a whole bunch right over here. On this long run. Yeah, um, it's a, oh, it's a small case, you gotta go over twice. With the, uh, big cat. You gotta go around and get rid of all your piles. Yeah, I'm looking at I'm looking at I'm setting on one right now. So when you back up, I'm gonna back up and, and run it the other way. You got it. And then I'll go off the other side, go behind you, pick up the airlines. I'm just pushing dirt, that's all I know. I'm trying to push it more to the left here because we're close to that left edge. I figured I'd just shove it off. Or try to anyway. We'll spin around and do the same thing when we push it to the right. Yep. Getting there, we get yeah, three of these was definitely the way to go. One would have taken forever. I'll give this all something to do too. Yeah. That wall of dirt over there. Looks like the Game of Thrones throne. Yep. I gave up on not using it. I mean, you can kind of see too. Like some of the ground looks more raised than the other, so you right. can kind of see it. It just, it's easier. Just use the sight. Be done with it. Yeah. Right here. Getting there. I wish. I really wish they'd fix the daylight cycle. The daylight's two times as long as the nighttime. Yeah. Because I think it's backwards. I still don't think they fixed that at all yet. I got the 99. Grab this little hump you guys left behind here. I think it's... Be done. Yeah, that's that hump right there. Pretty much it. Game of chicken. Oh, you want to go up? Um, we'll go up. <laughs> still at 99. Ramp to get out of here. Hey, we gotta be getting close, right? There we go. There we go. 
I'm out of here. Digging me a tunnel. Get out of here. Side. Oh, well. It <laughs> uh, looks like more than a tunnel. Where's our other vehicle? Are they still at the other place? Yeah. Most of them are anyway. Yeah. All the ones away. that were used there. Yeah. Which wasn't much. I need the excavator. Oh, yeah. Hello, you big suck. Hello. Sorry, it's, I don't have the easiest thing to park here, you know? What do you mean? A 50 ton I, dozer is not easy to park? I mean, it only takes up four, four parking spots, so. Yeah, it's fine, man. It's not that, it's not that difficult. Did I help you with the trench or no? You, no. you did, yeah. I'm about, to, I'm about to drive right in that bad boy. Um, I, you might be able to just drag and scoop this or drag it. Yeah, it looks like footings. And drag. Yeah, it looks like footings. Yeah. That's probably what I'll do. Oh, yeah, look at here. Made me a little road. Thanks, Bill. Yeah. <laughs> a little bumpy. That was the plan all the time. Yeah, a little, a little bumpy. It's all good, though. Well, I mean, I didn't have a chance to go, you know, over it twice, so. To smooth it out for you. Yeah, it worked out, though. A little road right on out there. The delivery site is right outside here. Is there a crane site, though? There should be, because there's definitely crane work. So I'm not seeing a crane site, though. Um, Because usually the crane site is already here. Oh, maybe it's after we do this it pops up. Yeah, unless we got to do everything <laughs> with a mobile crane, but... I mean, that's fine, too. We'll get two of those bad boys out. I don't care. We don't need to save money. Nah. No. No, definitely. It doesn't matter. Yeah, money comes way too easy in this game. Just, yeah, all you have to do is do uh, road paving jobs and you're fine. Yeah, the drag, the drag, I wouldn't even scoop. I would just drag. Drag it all the way back. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah, oh, get what your the... bucket down as far as it needs to go, and you missed the beginning, though. Yeah, because you're not making that deep of a hole. Get on me. Yeah, I wouldn't scoop. I would just drag. Well, I'm just... I, I've already drug all, all this out, right? I'm just getting the rest of that where I miss. Always. Oh, it's a little... Yeah, I see what you're talking about. It's a little... A little wider in that area. Yep. I'm just getting the part that I missed there. That's all. Yeah, it's not... It's not much, though. So yeah. You don't have to go... You don't, you don't have to go down deep here. No. All right. There we go. Got that part. No, no, back, back up, you cr what the? I'm holding reverse and it's like spinning me in circles for some reason. I don't know what in the crap. Yeah, you might have to do it twice, so. Well, if I could keep this thing going straight, that'd be helpful. Like, no matter what I do, it's trying to, it's trying to pull to the right for some reason. Might be a good opportunity to just do this. You want a second excavator over here? Uh, I mean, yeah, if you want. It's fine with me. Right, go to the store. Enter. Yeah, I feel like we're going to have a lot of prefab stuff to do, so. Just rent it. I'm going to get the Atlas because I've never got the Atlas. Before. You got to accept it. There yeah. you go. Let's see how big this one is. Itty bitty leaving space. Man, it's not that bad. I mean, I could have got the. the uh, I can't think of what it is now. 
the real little one. Oh, the wheeled one? Yeah. It's got, a, it's got a the, wide uh, bucket on it, though. The bucket loader. With the tobacco on it. The the wheeled the wheeled excavator has a has a really wide bucket. But it just gets stuck in the ground all the time. This thing is slow, I know that much. Maybe if I turn on my lights it'll go faster. I can go light speed. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, light right, you guys speed. can't hear that. I hit my put um Oh, I don't have to push through the Discord. Hey, I just make jokes. I don't. I can't guarantee if they're funny or not. I'm, I'm, I, I don't specialize in legs, so they're not all humorous. I was pretty sure you were a bone doctor. Sometimes, yes. Across the street there, apparently they got skip the dishes and Uber delivery. You guys are now talking to each other. <laughs> One's driving a Lexus and the other one is driving a, what the heck is that? Oh, that's one. Okay. Okay, what the hell? I can't drive backwards. Well, not when you're building soil up like that. I'm not doing anything. It's just like freaking out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the Z-axis problems. That's why I always just stick with the cats. Quit freaking out. Yeah, it's giving you zero percentage there, Bone. I noticed that. Yeah. Yeah, that, that one's completely busted. That one and the orange one. Gotta have that caterpillar, man. Yep. Yeah. yeah, can you tell who put the, the most money into it? Oh, into the game? Or at least has quality control over their equipment anyway. Yeah. Jeez, oh, piece, this thing is just constantly freaking out. I can't even get straight on this thing. All right, this is, might have just been a complete waste of time. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we just bought another caterpillar. Well, this is why I rented this thing, so. We know this one works. So. Oh, I think I'm stuck. I don't know what I'm stuck on, though. What are we stuck on? Oh, we're stuck on a little pile of dirt. That's what it is. That seems reasonable. Yeah, that, that little bit of a itty bitty there. I might have to go grab the dozer to get you out, eh? <laughs> yeah, this is perfectly reasonable. Because, you know, this is what excavators do. Yeah, vehicles. Yeah. yeah, I'm I'm stuck too. I'm trying to get oh, out. Oh, that's hilarious. Like it wasn't There's this no bad before you the update. Be yeah. This is oh, way man. worse now. Wow. I got it. Holy smokes, man. Yeah. <laughs> Watching you two dance here at the Dance Invaders is kind of funny. <laughs> I'm just spinning my tracks here. I could have made a short what just out of you two just doing around the spins and everything there. That was great. Square dancing ex excavator. The do -si do and away you go. So something I just noticed, Gargoyle, I can only do, um, there are times where I can't, um, with the left, right thumbstick, yeah. I can only use two axes at a time sometimes. Sometimes it locks and it won't let me use another one until I let off the other side. But like, I can't huh. go at angles to do like four inputs at once. Huh. And it wasn't like this before the update. Be, 
Yeah, I was gonna say, I haven't tried it since the update, but yeah, before we used to have no problems doing that. Yeah, I mean, that's the reason I like using the controller, because that's what, that's the point of thumbsticks and joysticks, is that you can move... Exactly. ...all ways you need to at the same time. I think you're stuck now there, Deuce. You're uh, just spinning your tracks, going nowhere. A little bit. A little bit. Well, I, that's, I got it. We'll get out of here. Yeah, you're running on the spot. We'll get out of You'd here. You'd think that you'd be able to, you know, put your bucket down and help yourself creep along, but instead it just piles dirt up to the sky under the bucket when you do that. Yep. Well, it's because there's there's no the hitbox for it's not the not the teeth in, it's the teeth around the bucket, like from the bucket, teeth, yeah, and then all the way around the bucket back to the arm, yeah. Like I'm trying to turn, nothing's working. Nothing's I'm, going on yet. Oh, 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 there we go. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. A little more. And... Okay. Well, we'll go this way then. And I've got my headlights there on, but go. they are not, uh, they're not doing anything. Nope. Uh, no, my lights are off too. In game. I guess just pitch black in the cab here. Once six o'clock hits, that's it. You got no more lights. Lights out. 88%. Dude, this hole, this, this hole is completely dug out between all the lines. And I'm still only at 89%. Well, I mean, you're higher than I am. I mean, yeah, that's true. I'm rocking a nice 8% here. Oh, we're going up to 9. 10. Ooh, look at me go. You're actually doing more digging than the bucket. Yeah, I, I can't keep straight though. That's that's the problem here too. Oh, and then we got. Look at that. If I stop, it just starts getting a big pile of dirt. That's what I just drug all mine to the end and then scooped it out. That seemed to work pretty well, honestly. Yeah, from what I'm seeing here, Deuce, it just looks like it's your edges that are high. Get to the uh, engineer side. That seems and about right. I'm about right here, all the way towards you, is too high for the ditch. You gotta go a little bit deeper. Well, that one, that's when I, was, I literally just backed up, so that seems that seems plausible, yeah. I just didn't drag deep enough. I have more dirt piled up next to me than what I've taken out of the hole. Oh, yeah, yeah, yours is showing. Uh, you have a little bit of green here, <laughs> but everything else is all deep red everywhere. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, look at how much dirt is on the outside, though. Yeah, yeah, I've seen that, yeah. Let's see if I can get in position here again. Without getting stuck on a dirt Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to grab the pills here and see if I can get the boys out. Ah, oh, why doesn't that remember where my views are? <laughs> Yeah, I, f I for some reason feel like they did more damage than good with that update. Yeah. Like, I like the sentiment. I like being able to, to keep on stuff, but it just feels like more stuff is broken now. So. Oh, I can't go straight. No, that's no chance. I tried to help you out. Turning this uh, thing here. Turn the atlas and get something a bit better. Yeah, get another cat. Well, let's see. What else can we get? Try the wheeled thing, man. It's got that wide bucket on there. It's perfect for this kind of stuff. I you know it's just when we get stuck, though. And you say that. Touching your ditch there, Bone, but I am moving all that dirt that's on the side. See, that the one side has uh, outrigger, so I don't know if I can put it, I can use the, the bucket and drive it at the same time. Oh, you know what? You're probably right. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Tater Salad? How's it going, buddy? Let's just get the cat. Hey, Tater. 
Now, for some reason, I'm stuck on a dirt clot again. back into this ditch to get the rest of this now. I'm trying to figure out how to get to my track here. Ninety nine percent to the reason. I keep getting stuck on, you know, six inches of dirt in an excavator that could crawl over a car. So. I mean it makes sense though. No, I'm well, good. I'm just trying to... to the level of, uh, over here, Gargo. I mean, if you kept on dozing, I'm sure we'd get to the level here. I tried. It wasn't doing. It wasn't giving me any pluses on the other end. So I was like, ah, fine. I'll just make it so you have room for your tracks. I just gotta get out of here. dirt when I stop. That is stupid. Yeah, no, it just keeps building. I hate yeah. that. Yeah. If you're past the, the level where it wants you to go for the for the depth, you <laughs> just sit there and just build dirt and build dirt and build dirt. That gigantic build up you got there. Yeah. It went down 10% just on this. Oh. I gotta dig myself out now. What an absolute mess. Well, well that didn't actually do anything either. Why can't I pull this? Seriously. I mean, you may be Come a little on. deep. That's that's pretty deep. I don't think so. <laughs> Round we go. There you go. Now you're getting it. Oh, you're you're kind of off to the side though. You're yeah, not right. actually. I, I there's I don't see the line anymore. So behind you, like you're going at an angle. Get the shovels out every time. Sometimes it's just easier. Do it the easy way. Lots of pain and anguish, you know. Yeah, this right here is actually the line, Bone. Yeah, I'm, I'm stuck. We'll get unstuck. If only there was a machine that could drive over dirt. Huh. Be interesting. Maybe with a big bucket on the front of it that you could scoop dirt to. Yeah. And it's got I mean, enough uh, hydraulic pressure to pick itself up with the bucket. Be fantastic. I mean, Never heard of it, though. No. Didn't invent one. I mean, seriously, what am I stuck on? <laughs> I can't move. We could call it the dirt extractor. 
The distractinator. The distractinator, yes. Because you gotta have a nader on it, right? Yes. Yeah. All right, can I go forward? No, I am stuck. <laughs> Tater seduce construction. We get the job kind of done. Call now. <laughs> we might pick up. <laughs> yeah. uh, that's, that seems about right, yeah. I have no idea what I'm stuck on. Dirt. <sighs> little yeah. little pile of dirt. That's it. All right, off we go. Yeah. Okay. Now, turn. Turn. No. Yep. There we go. Turn. Okay. Good. We're moving. We're moving somewhat. Oh boy. Gargo, you helping I'm push? More yeah. Done with the dozer than you guys are getting done with the excavator. <laughs> That's weird, considering we're supposed to be digging a hole, not pushing dirt into it, but. Yeah. I'm not pushing dirt into it. I'm I know, I know what I'm saying. It's like a certain level, it's just pushing it out. Like, all right, that works. Very strange. Yeah. I'm uh, I'm a little stuck. You're just a little stuck. Yeah. The vehicle shouldn't get stuck this easy. Uh, not. You, you see what I'm stuck on? Like, you see this? Yep. Like, there's no way. <laughs> There's no way that happens. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That thing should have crawled across that no problem right there. Yeah, I'm. I'm. Oh, no, I'm not stuck. Okay. Yeah, and I can't push you either, eh? That sucks. Ah, there we go. All right, this is as far as I guess I can go. I'm pushing dirt back this, into it, though. This, this little pile of dirt is stopping me from moving forward. <clears throat> Fifty-five percent. We're almost. We're almost getting there. Anything you build up, I'm pushing out of that hole for you. All right, I'm trying to move. I can't go straight though. That's the hard thing. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Just lift your bucket up. Straight up. Oh, I think I'm stuck again. Beauty. Alright. Go over here and see if we can push some more out the other direction. Oh yeah, definitely stuck again. Okay, there we go. Yeah, the dozer should not be doing as much work as it is. Yeah, it's doing a better job anyway, so I'm just going to yeah, go I'm straight down the street. Yeah, I'm getting out of the vehicle and returning it. Uh, what is the rental one? That's the one with the clock. So I'll just clean it up, and finish it. Yeah, let, let the let the. I mean, dude, it. I'm I'm making some progress here. That was me. That wasn't you. <laughs> no, no, it was me. It was me. I'm, I'm see your screen. Like I can't move now because I'm out of dirt to move. But what? See, one percent right there. I'm making progress. <laughs> well, I mean, I can't, can't, uh, can't really yeah. get out of here. So let me push. Yeah, Wonder push. Burst. I'm going. You're pushing the wrong side. I'm going that way. Oh. Pushing against me. Go the other side. Push. Push. Yeah, that's not working. <laughs> Come on, bone. Push it. I'll get a running, jumping start. Yeah, there you go. Oh, oh, look at that. We moved a little bit. Yeah, the dozer should not be even working for this. That's kind of silly. No. 
Yeah, no, I can't even push you either, eh? Hang on, I got an idea. There you go. You should be able to... Yeah. Are you stuck on one of the pegs? There we go. I think that's what I got stuck on down there, too, was one of the pegs. There we go. Now we're out. Dude, it should climb this dirt pile right here without even thinking about it. Like, there should be zero reason for this thing not to crawl straight up and over all this stuff. Uh, Gargle, if you come down and on the other side, that should take all of it out. Alright, so yeah. Yeah. We're gonna need this back in there, you think? I hope not. <laughs> I mean, that's reasonable. I mean, we've made uh, quite a mess, though, I gotta say that. That's right. The helper's gonna come in and clean it all up for us. Now we know we can do do it with the bulldozer, though. Because, yeah, is he got it done. So very silly. Yeah, look at all the freaking dirt piles everywhere. It's just so silly that that's... <laughs> that's even a thing. It's supposed to be footings. Like, you're supposed to just be digging out a trench for the, for the footings. Yeah, well, I guess we got to work smarter, not harder. I mean, why remove some of the dirt when you can remove all of it? <laughs> yeah, really. yeah, just remove the entire area. Wow, yeah. look at how flat it is now. Yeah, it looks good. See, that's that's what the footings look like. That's what we were doing. Look at it. Look at how nice we dug that. That's perfect. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Perfectly, perfectly dug. It's like we knew what we were doing. Yeah. Oh, yep. Now the crane site goes up. All um, right. We also need uh, materials, right? Yeah. I'll put the crane up, uh, but I'll need to prude. I'll go with the tall one, I guess. I mean, Do you see it, how they dug this out? Technically, you're supposed to come in on the angle and dig it out on a 90, not parallel with it. Like, come on. Each individual yeah. scoop? No, thanks. Yeah. All right, there we go. I got to do the crane again? Yep. It timed out? Okay. Sorry, I was in the store. No, nope, no problem. Everything is delivered. Uh, do we need the crane truck down here, you think? I did the crane the last time. Someone else can do the crane this time. Oh. I'll, I'll, I'll be the unpacker. Fine. Oh, Gargoyle's taking me with him. <laughs> what can I say? I have an attraction. A magnetic personality. Yeah. We are OSHA. What are you talking about, Tater? <laughs> All right, what do I need down there, sir? Uh, steel beam. Pallet of concrete. Pallet of wood. And rebar. Okay. Rebar. Grab this outside one. And everything's getting dropped off right in front of us, too. Curbside delivery. Hopefully... We can do one and unpack, but no, not yet. All right, what's next? Um, steel beams. But these things right here? The ones in the middle there. Yep. These guys? Uh, no. Not the those? One next to it. This one. Uh, these, what I'm walking on right now. That's yeah, I beam. can't see my white marker because you're in front of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were you were actually blocking it, which is really weird. I didn't see that happen yet. And Where do these go? Yeah. Right oh, here. Go. Right over by me. Yep. Just drop it on gargoyle, it's fine. Yep. Good. Boom. Okay, what's okay. next? Pat pal of concrete elements. That's the green all the way at the end. Okay. And then uh the last thing is a pallet of wood. Which is that's the big square ones, right? 
I think. Oh. I, well, yeah, it doesn't say the four by fours, but I don't. I mean, we have three different types of wood here. It's not that one. It's not that one. Ah, oh, yeah, it's that one that you're sitting right in front of. Yep. Yeah, the, the four by fours. Yeah. Or the one at the end. Uh, let me just get real close. Okay, so first person. It looks like you, the sheets, oh, it's, right? Yeah, it's uh, one by sixes. Yeah, the the one at the end, uh, Deuce. There yeah. you go. Okay. Man, Nailed you get, like, it. Right up on top of that blue in order to see what they want. Yeah. And then after this should be pumping, right? Oh. Now you oh, got to no. put in the, the foundation blocks. Okay, then. So, yep. There's a lot of them. Now I see Is why it? they're saying bring the mobile crane. <laughs> yeah, go grab the mobile crane. To help out with this. This, this is... Yeah. This is a lot, dude. <laughs> Three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You, you grabbing it, gargoyle? Yep. Okay. Yeah, you guys get one side. I'll get the other. Or I may hand this off to one of you for a second. Let me hit the outhouse. And I'll take it back over when I get back. Killing a twenty ounce cup of coffee before you stream is probably not the best idea. It's the best idea. I mean, it is. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to move this back over, and whoever's not getting the other thing, if you'll take this over yep. for just a second, I'll be right back. I'll grab it. Okay. Let me know when you're out. I'm out. Okay. We'll give you guys a first-person view of the pickup and drop-off, and uh, give you their view, too, and I'll be right back. Why don't you turn green? It's not envious. Okay. Is there are two different styles. Oh boy, I see him going in. I am back. I might as well finish. There's only four more left to go. Oh. And then I'll hop out of the crane. Whoa, hey, hey. hey. Pick up deuce. Hey, that's, <laughs> that's my noggin there. Yeah, you're not using it anyways, are you? That's very true, yeah. Oh yeah, I gotta do that closest one there. Uh, the one that, yeah, that one right there. Yeah. I cannot reach the farthest. I mean, you could if you move closer. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, excuses, excuses here.
Was that a little bit faster? I'm assuming you'd still be working on one side if we not brought that down. And there's a lot more stuff too, so I guess having it down here is probably going to be a good idea. I do want to buy one of the big, the big mobile cranes at some point, though. This is the big oh, one. No. No, 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 no. There's one with another set of wheels on it. Oh yeah, 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 okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. This isn't the big caterpillar one here. Mm. Or the lever. Yeah, the li liverman or whatever it is. Yeah. Yep. All right, cool. Oh. Now we put post in. Mm. No pillars. Yep. That's all you. I'm out. <sighs> okay. Fine. <laughs> I built. I, I built Chinatown. I built the entire college. That is true. Gargle was in the crane the entire college, wasn't he? And Deuce did the entire Ferris wheel. I did, yeah. That was a That's lot, too. <laughs> that was a lot. Ferris wheel had a lot going on. Ah, I did it again. I reset when I tried to change mode. Oh, don't you hate that? Oh, so I mean, frustrating. A couple of guys oh, could probably just pick this up, though. Carry it over there. It's just a still I beam, isn't it? I mean, yeah, I mean, it's just a railroad track. What's only four, you know, four people, dude? Pounds. You picked that up. How much do you think those things weigh? Oh, well over five hundred. Yeah, I was gonna say eight to eight hundred to a thousand pounds. Yeah. Yeah, me and me and about fourteen other people could pick that up. <laughs> you could drag it. Yeah. Well, I'll say fourteen because yeah. you put seven yeah. on each side and I'd stand there. But. Well, yeah, me telling 14 people, we could do it. Yeah, it'd be easy, man. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going to red in the face for This is easy. <laughs> Nothing to it. Yeah, I'd be sitting back it. drinking my drink and, hey, yep, hey, come on. No, no, faster, come on. That's why I'm sitting there drinking coffee while I'm in the crane. I only need, like, one hand most of the time to move the crane around, so... Up we go. I do like how this is, like, on a construction, if you're putting up beams like this, like verticals, they would be laying flat, and you would hook to the top of them. So I, I like the fact that it's kind of, right, you know, done somewhat intelligently like it would be on a job site. That's pretty neat. I think, anyway. Uh, I've never actually done this, but every time I've ever seen construction sites, their vertical beams are always laying flat, and they pick them up, and then they got the... Are they tension ropes or whatever to keep them from swinging everywhere? Like, yep. yeah. Guide wires, you know. Mm -hmm. That, yes. I got me some more coffee while I was going. Oh, that's good. Yes, because, you know, coffee at 3 o'clock in the afternoon is never kept anybody up at night. Which, there are people that say I drink coffee at midnight. That was that was my dad. Like my dad be drinking coffee at, and then go to bed. <laughs> like, yeah, dude, I don't understand <laughs> you, man. <laughs> and, and their hearts racing at 120 beats per minute yeah. all day long. I don't know, dude. My my dad drank three pots of coffee basically his entire adult life that I remember, um, and I'm pretty sure uh, 250 beats per minute was normal for him. Jeez. <laughs> three pots of coffee a day, so. Wow, I mean that's 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 a lot of uh, tachycardia right there. Yeah, that's a lot of caffeine. Yeah. Well, when he started having uh, having health issues, right? He started out with it's like uh, his right arm or whatever was uh, bugging her up, quit quivering a bit. You know, like he couldn't keep food on the fork, so he started eating with his left hand. He didn't tell mom, of course, but ended up having so ALS, that, of course. So was um, it only when he moved? Uh, that he had the tremor? No, no, it was, I mean, it was when he was trying to, like, hold something. So it was like... Yeah, so that's uh, that's called an essential tremor. I'm yeah. just learning all this stuff now due to my issues. So. Right, right. But, I mean, his ended up being due to, like, his muscles deteriorating, basically. Yeah. So that's, that's, that's yeah, all it's it an was. essential tremor. Yeah. But, but so, as it, as it got worse, um, he started drinking coffee out of a straw. Yep. I and I'm like... Because he couldn't pick the coffee cup up anymore. And I'm like, That's, okay, yeah. I, I realize that you got to have your coffee. But, Pop, you're drinking scalding hot coffee through a straw. Think about yeah. that for a minute. <laughs> like, <laughs> Use a metal straw. It won't melt so fast, man. Yeah, so, I'm like, think about that, man. Like, you, you're drinking scalding hot coffee through a straw. Like, 
He's like, yeah, and? <laughs> it's like, okay then. <laughs> Never mind. Right. If you don't see a Here problem with it, whatever. Alright, what's next? Concrete. Oh, concrete you truck. Drive the truck all the way around the uh, the edge and pour it all in. I don't know if the truck will do it. Oh no, we get the uh, we get the other one. I'm gonna try the truck. Are you gonna try the truck on itself? The inside of it, you can you can if you can Whoa. get inside it, you're good. You're good. Perfect. He got inside Look of it. That. Yeah. yeah. Dude, that was that was straight out of Fast and the Furious right there. Yeah. Like he didn't even touch the the. Mm -hmm. The, sub, the the wooden supports here on the side. No, Nothing. he just flew over it. He, he flew right it. over it, man. Yeah. Well, yeah, how else would you do it? I don't know. I'm pretty sure I saw Letty do that in Fast and Furious 4, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. She took it from the dudes. I mean, basically, that's... Yeah. Pretty much. Oh, I, I got the... Closer. Now, that is going to be cool if you can uh, do that and just drive... Like, just pull all the way down through there. and drive, yeah probably going to be easier for me to go forward than backwards. Probably. Oh, see, now you've done it. Now you're in the I ditch. Get out. Oh, maybe. Come on, truck. There we go. Dro drop your tag axle there. Give you a little more. Yeah. A little more support. Uh, I got Caveman for his birthday a Mario Kart uh, slot racer. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, man. He just absolutely loves it. It's too bad that he can't take it to his mom's because she's got all this carpet and the static would, and carpet would just destroy it. All right, I'm going to try to pour. But I got to fill it up first. There you go. Oh, you're missing. Oh, you're missing. You're it's going close. over. It's going too over. Close to the edge. Yeah. Stop it. Turn it off. You're wasting concrete. <laughs> no, actually, you don't. <laughs> I, wish, I wish it was closer to the life like that, but oh. no. Yep, Getting the camera no. angle just right for me too is hard because it always wants to rotate when I'm moving. Like it looks there like you if you're Perfect. just up there on the flat area, you're good. Oh yeah, look Six, at seven, you go. Eight, nine, ten. Yeah. Yeah, you got to come back just a bit. On. Oh, how, do we have flashlight? What's the flashlight button? Uh, I'm looking for it. See if we got one. No. Nope, oh we no, don't. we don't have one. Dang it. No. Oh, what the world? I just re reset myself out to the road. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, how come we don't have flashlights, shoot. man? We're on a dangerous construction site. We should have flashlights. Yeah. yeah, we should have those intrinsic flashlights. They cause no static, so we won't set any H2S off. LED lights. Not intrinsic. Are they not? They still set the stuff off? Yep. Oh. Well, that's not good. Fire truck and then two ambulances just went whipping by in front of my house. Yeah, it's never good. And my poor neighbor. He bought his uh, Dodge Ram about six months ago. I saw him get up this morning, go up for his normal coffee on the weekends. He runs the Timmy's. Came back and he's got a big old dunt in the uh, driver's side front bumper. Yeah. Dynamic. It's a Dodge, though. It's fine. My, my yeah. dash looks like uh, a dried up desert, but that sucker still runs. So. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Have you gotten the squeak yet? Uh, my depends dash on which squeaks. one. <laughs> <laughs> my dash squeaks. If I move the steering wheel up and down here, <laughs> coming on my dash. <laughs> oh, no. Mine's not that. Mine, mine just rattles because there's so many cracks in it. Those mm. things do not do well in the heat and the and the humidity. No, uh, those no. dash. The, I mean, it, especially because it's like a 2003 model. So that model, that those those models specifically, like 95 to like 2008, yeah. like the dash on them was just terrible. A couple of summers in the sun and it's cracking. That plasticky, dimpled, whatever yeah. type thing on it. You can never get coffee out of those little itty bitty dimples, no matter how much you soak it down. Come on. Well, I'd like to still have a concrete truck when you get done. You can, oh, you'll be fine. You can manage it. <laughs> He's slamming he'll, into he'll everything. He'll deductible for the insurance. He'll come out of his wages. Oh, that corner back there, Bone. Right here. There's a little bit missing. Uh, hopefully I don't have to get the front okay. axle and the... the... Fuel tank's already been punctured like nine different times at this point. Like it's... That's fine. Yeah. 
79 oh god 79 percent I mean, you know do. this is not the way that anyone would ever do concrete though so. no this would be, you'd have the concrete pumper out here no i mean you would have those channels that are on the side of the truck come yeah, exactly out. yep so they could reach Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. You'd be, you'd be probably right in Use the middle. The extenders. Yeah, you'd be right yeah. in the middle of this, this, or out here on the side, probably. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Be on the. I'd be on the outside. Yep. And then what you do is you turn it on and off, go around every bloody beam. Yep. Which, hey man, they get paid by the hour, so. Yeah, I can, get I can get it over here. Under it. There we go. Get out of there. I'm trying. Oh. Come on. <laughs> the concrete the spawn that <laughs> kept him from moving. All right, cool. Poor strip foundation. Is that? Right. Uh, this one you can oh, do from okay. the outside, though. Yep, right down here. Oh my god. <laughs> Thought he was about to kill everybody <laughs> on the other side of that fence. Hey, the guardrail made a good uh, a good runaway and freak. Yep. It did, yeah. That's why That's why it's there. I mean, that's right. No pedestrians were harmed in the making of this uh, shopping mall. Not yet. <laughs> that's, what's, that's what I was just thinking. Not yet. They will be soon. Give me, give me time. Yeah, he's still got a few minutes here, so. You notice how that puddles up once it fills up? Isn't that awesome? Yeah, I love that. Again, dude, they did just so good it. on so many things, but some yeah. of, like, the most basic stuff, they have just yeah. ruined. Yeah, you know, like I was saying, up. yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of like... They didn't have anybody go to university for game development, but they have a lot of good programmers. So, you know, like they can they can do a lot of good things with the graphics and the physics. But when it comes to the overall development, it's, it's severely lacking. Well, just the, from the gamer, from the player side of it is what they're missing. Yeah. 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 Well, that and um, the cement truck shouldn't just take off, too, when you're dumping fuel mm. or dumping cement. Yeah, you should have like a PTO speed. You know what I mean? You should be you know, limited down to like you know, ten mile an hour max. Well, I mean, there, mean there's no, it shoots off at ten miles an hour. Yeah, exactly. there should it's be there lunches. should be a a cruise control option to to set it at one miles an hour because that's about yeah. what you'd be doing. I mean, yeah. put it on one and just just creep. You know, that's or two maybe. I don't. I don't swing know. Probably there, You'll be able to do it. Swing and shoot. Yeah. Swing the shoot out. There you go. That's too that's too easy though. I mean, that that's true. Why would you do anything like that? Yeah. Hey, you're good. I, 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 gotta, I gotta move again. Yeah, you gotta swing the shoot around too now. Got like 40 different thousand things you're trying to do here. Yeah. I've, uh, so the, the Logitech joystick, it also swivels on the top as well. So I have my shoot set to that. So I can Logitech joystick? That. Which Logitech joystick? Oh, I we're good. The there you go. Screen 3D Pro. Who's on the dump truck? Uh, I mean, I guess I will. All right. Now, do you know how to spread it so you can gain gravel? You can gain gravel? Yeah. So what you do is you start lifting it until you start seeing the, the yellow bar drop, and then you, you bring it down, just tap, tap, bring it down, and uh, so it's not moving anymore, and just move back and forth, back and forth, and you'll slowly start gaining gravel in your, your dump truck as you're dumping. Uh, no, I've never tried that. Do you want to yeah. dump it? Because I don't know how to do that. Ah, it's all good. It's 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 just funny. It takes a little bit longer to do. I mean, I usually just barely like I, when I when I had my I'm gonna I'm gonna put my wheel back up real quick and turn it back on. I I can't. I'm stuck. Because when I have that, uh, it seems it makes to work life a lot so better. Much easier. Yeah, because yeah. I can just barely touch the gas and and creep forward and barely dump. Yeah. Uh, do we have the soil compactor here? Because we'll probably need the soil compactor too. Uh, oh, I didn't see that in the job. Let me just double check that. I'll I would you know. assume if you're pouring down gravel. Yep, gravel compaction. Yep, we do need that. Grab this. And then we'll be pouring slabs after that. I'll go grab it. Nope, still not recognizing it. Okay. Aw, oh, man. It's so dumb. Yeah, you might need to reset your software. I mean, that's a silly concept, too, because I was literally using it all day yesterday for farm sim. Side panel and everything, so it's, it's the game more than it is anything. Just not recognizing it for some reason. Uh, Moon asked a, bit, a little while ago there, um, what is the key command for allowing to create a field? I'm guessing that's for the multiplayer? Uh, it's in any 
It's just, it hits your F1. It says it when you have a plow behind you. I think it's Y if you're on a keyboard. I don't know what it is on a controller, but yeah, it's, uh, it's your, your F1 menu, Celtic Moon. That's, that's the best way to do anything in farm sim because it'll tell you. Whatever that menu is, I don't I don't know what it is for if you're if you're using a controller, but yeah. If you if you're ever having trouble, um, figure out what the key is. Just check that. Uh, check that yeah, F1 I mean, menu. This bow man doesn't have lights. No. But yeah, I think it's Y on a keyboard. I'd have to, have to look again. I think that's right, though. I think it's Y if you're on a keyboard, and then whatever. I don't know what it is on a controller, though. That thing spread all kind of off to the right. It didn't even dump right behind me. <laughs> and in my screen, it showed perfectly square. Yeah, it's dumping like most of it off to the right for some reason, which is really strange. I'd use the dozer to help smooth it, but unfortunately, you end up losing gravel that way. I've never lost uh, gravel that way. I've, I, usually, you can gain about 20% though. <laughs> well, the snow just slid off my roof. <laughs> All I hear is this girl, I'm up against the fence. <laughs> I know what that is. <laughs> Metal roof. Yeah, I was about to say, I don't think we've ever lost gravel doing, uh, doing it that way, Gargle. Using the dozer? Yeah, I, uh, it usually helps. Yeah. Yeah, you know, yeah. normally I, I end up just losing dirt or losing gravel. It's like, well, that's a pain in the butt. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> it's a body disposal site. I mean, that's, yeah, that's, that's reasonable. Yeah. I mean, who's building shopping malls right now anyways? Right? In this economy, nobody. Interest rates are way too Well, high. just not even this economy. Who's building shopping malls in the last 10 years? I mean, so, I, lo locally in different places, I don't know. But nationally, I, mean, I haven't heard of any major shopping malls being built in the last no, 10 nothing years. nothing major. So. No, I mean. If anything, all more malls are closing down than they are. Yeah, right. your brick and mortar stores are going away. Yep. Online shopping killed the mom, or uh, killed the uh, the larger corporate stores. I guess only well, like Well, no, the corporate stores, just all they had to do was lower their prices. Yep. And they didn't want to do that. Because of all their, they have too much cost. Oh, I got to clear this area? Come on. Yeehaw! Yeah, I may have to go back in and just reprogram all my my keys and stuff for the for the wheel. Oh, now the look wheel. at where all the gravel went. That's Way not everywhere. where you spread it all. <laughs> Nailed it. Trying to get in the parking spot here. Nice. Yeah. God, it's still nighttime, guys. I swear to God, the nighttime is two times as long as the daytime in this game. Yeah. The only time it was daytime was when we were putting in the pillars. Yeah. Everything else is dark in the game. Jeff, how's it going, buddy? Hope you're doing well. Uh oh, there you go. Okay. Oh wow, what is what is this? That's not where I put gravel. You're right. I know. What in the world? Do we need the other <laughs> compactor or are we good? It's just this yellow area. Okay, so. yeah, we're good then. You don't have two uh, soil compactors, do you? I do, specifically for that reason. I know we bought two of a lot of things, but I didn't know we bought two soil compactors. Oh, yeah. Definitely. It's either that or two asphalt compactors. I can't it might remember. be asphalt, but... Yeah. 
when you because yeah, I know the last community forever. day you had, you did all the roads. Uh, as fall compactor. No, I have two soul compactors. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I know why. Because when we did the um, when we did the hotel, the resort or whatever, we had so much area that we oh, needed to compact. Right. Yeah, yeah, we just yeah, I just went and grabbed another massive. one. <laughs> so Celtic Moon, if you're on the multiplayer server uh, on the farm, I've already outlined, and it's a huge outline. Uh, I've already outlined everything back over to our field four and eight there. Basically, uh, I didn't get into field four because it's already got soybeans in it. So one thing I noticed though is that it's nicer to jump in and out of the trucks now after this update. You're not having to wait for a second and then move your camera right right yeah it is a little bit better i still had mine do the weird thing while i go over and like push my camera into the ground i'm looking straight up but straight up yeah uh for the most part though a lot of that's been fixed and i, I really appreciate that because oh so, hey uh, daylight made me a little motion sick if i was doing a lot of jumping around between vehicles yeah for sure oh dude there's a there's a plane you can even see the jet the jet, jet streak from the plane jets yeah yeah yep. the trail that's crazy dude chem trail the yeah. chem trail there you go Altering the weather. Oh, I probably shouldn't say that. When, People are getting like banned on when YouTube. When you're in the crane, you can hear the planes fly by. <laughs> it was totally a joke. <laughs> I was just joking. <laughs> like, something like H3 or something like that ended up getting their wrists slapped for saying something. I don't know what it was that he said, but apparently, I guess it was pretty pretty rough. Well, he's had a lot of opinions over the years, so. Yeah. What's this guy's name? Ethan, right? Yep. I've never actually watched any of his podcasts or anything. I just catch it on the news. Yeah, so the only yeah, time yeah. you're going to need to create field Celtic Moon is, is when you're not on like a already, an already pre-made field. But there's a lot of that. There's a lot of that that's going to need to create field. All right, cool. Bone is done with that part. Clear the site. Get out of there, Bone. Dang, man. I'm in it too. I'm as fast as I can. I was in it too. Oh, now we're gonna need the the concrete truck, aren't we? Oh, uh, nope. I think Gargo was in it. Yeah. No, no, I meant the pump, the pumper. Nope, Gargo's just oh. gonna do it the easy way. <laughs> like he's riding on glass up there. So what do you do? Do you just swing that thing back and forth as you move? There really should be a cruise control, man. Like the dump truck yeah. when you start raising it. It automatically yeah. kicks it down to like low speed or whatever. It should do that with the concrete truck too. It's silly that it doesn't. Yeah, I, I mean, think it just takes off. Yeah. And if you're using a wheel and pedal, you can just barely hit that gas pedal and be good. But like even a controller, when you pull the trigger, it starts going. Like it just goes. <laughs> like just barely yeah, pull the trigger. And I use this. I use the same controller playing trials and playing ninja tracks, which you have to go like. I mean, throttle control is like it's minute yeah. input, like, and I can do that, but I can't barely move a truck in this game with a controller. Dang, that's expensive. Yep. Making one point two million total off this though. So. Uh, the tree be gone? You could not cut trees on your land. That's not true at all. Celtic Moon. I went through and cut all the trees down. Uh, for the most part, there's still some I gotta cut, but... Oh, not on your land. Uh, yeah, no, that's not true either, because I cut down some that I thought we'd already owned, but I looked, yeah, I looked when I started plowing and we didn't own that land yet, so... Uh, oh, maybe it's because I was logged in as admin, though. So you can't cut trees not on our land if you're not logged in as admin, I think is probably the case. That makes sense. Yeah, that just keeps people from going through and clearing off the trees or whatever. So yeah, that makes exactly. sense. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, otherwise um, you'll just get one guy who just does nothing but logging and takes all the trees from everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, so, so yeah, no, yeah, the, the land o not owned by us, yeah, you won't be able to cut the trees down with the tree be gone. And that's that's the case for any anything, chainsaw or whatever, so. Looking good, Gargoyle, looking good. Uh, but, yeah, so, so all that should be good, though. Um, all the trees that are not on our land are, have, have already been cut, I think. The only ones that need to be cut are the ones on the main road up to the main farm. I don't think I got... I may have gotten all those, actually. Basically, if you're plowing and you run into trees, just, just go grab the tree be gone and cut it down. That's what I was doing when I was doing my 
uh, outline there. The outline is massive, though. There's going to be one massive soybean harvest. Uh, it's going to be pretty wild. Yeah, you shouldn't, there shouldn't be a whole lot more to cut down. They should be pretty well out of the way. There may be one or two as we're like, as we're kind of plowing the fields together or whatever that need to be moved that I missed, but I thought I got most of them last night, so. I was only up to like 130 or so cutting trees. So. <laughs> the finale is going to be fun. We're selling off all the product that we can sell. Not, not like the cows and stuff, but like product itself. Oh, and so stuff at the bakery and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, just bread and, and any, any complete product or, or anything that's not a raw product. So, like, sugar will sell because it's not a raw product. You actually have to produce it. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, all the all the made product, and then we're selling off um, all the extra crop that we have stored up, and then we're going to do a soybean harvest on about 300 acres. So. And you guys have a lot of stuff that hasn't been sold in a while, so. Yeah, tons of stuff. Yeah, you'll make a pretty payday on that. Should, anyway, yeah. yeah. GG's an expert at this. He really is. This looks good, doesn't it? I mean, he's knocking this out. Like, I don't think this is the way you, you wouldn't actually drive out here on the rebar, but uh, you'd use the pumper truck. But uh, it's still, though, doing a good job of it. I just wish that we had that little control feature, you know, like you say, that one mile an hour cruise control. Yeah, if they would just put a cruise control in the game, I would be, I would, I would overlook a lot of the other stuff because I know a lot of the stuff is just going to need patching. You know, like it's going to get fixed at some point. So, yeah, cruise no, control though, like that would work great. definitely needs to be fixed. Like, well, fixed. They need to add a cruise control, I guess. The cows are dead. They don't die when they're not playing in seasons. How are they dead? You know nothing about feeding the cows. So the cow pen has three things on the back of it. Um, there is silage hay and straw, or silage, yeah, silage hay and straw on the back side. And you just literally take silage hay and straw and dump it in their positions. And then the, the self feeder feeds them. So, but they had food yesterday. Like what happened? <laughs> we just, we were just over there yesterday. We had food on there. Oh, now we gotta do the other side. Here's the marked foundation. Dang, look at that string of concrete. <laughs> it's just laid out there. Clear the marked area. I thought I had cleared the marked area. Oh, bone was in it. Yeah, it was me. Oh, uh, I was looking, I was like, what? Yeah, the cows just had food yesterday. How did they die? And they're not even supposed to die if it's not all seasons. That's weird. That's a lot of concrete. That's a lot of concrete. Would it have been easier with the pumper? No. No? Okay. Nah, it's just because all you're doing is driving. I mean, that's true, yeah. You get a bloody menu right in the way you can't see where the shoot is. This piece of equipment is empty. Please refill. Yep. Yeah, it's like, well, thanks, but now I can't see the shoot. The pop-up lasts for freaking ever, so. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Excuse me there, Whoa! Dude. Excuse me. Come Whoa! Through. Excuse me. Come through. <laughs> I'm just trying to watch your progress, man. Making sure you're doing it right. But you're doing a lot better job than I would be, so. Yeah, we would be, while he's doing that, we'd be out using hand tools, getting, you know, air out and all that good stuff. Exactly, you know? troweling, yeah. I wish they had yeah. the little, uh, what's the, what's the, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I wish they had one of those in the game. The 30-foot the stick on it, dragging it across. Oh, that's the screeter. The screeter, yeah. There you go. And then, then you have to use the little buffing machine as it gets as it starts to cure. Yeah, that's the power trial. Yeah, yeah there you go. That thing. I don't know what all this stuff's called. I've just seen it. <laughs> I've only seen been building in two garages in my lifetime. <laughs> seen it used. Nearly had concrete boots. I did. Yeah, look at Bone. Bone's trying to get concrete boots. It's not working. We still have two whole um, campaigns to go after this before the finale, by the way. Mm-hmm. Not bad. That's a lot. At least, 
yeah, at least it has a lot of content this game. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's true. Uh, I just hate that a lot of people got, like, I mean, when I say a lot of people, there was a lot of big content creators that got this game, like, three weeks early. And they basically beat the game before it came out, and everybody's already seen it. So it's like... Yeah, uh, what was it? The uh, Brad M70, something like that? Adam. I mean, there, dude, there was a lot. There was a lot. Like, Raptor, Raptor and his crew beat the game before it even came out, so... Yeah. Yeah. Like, dang, man. Well, and I don't understand, like, as a developer or a publisher, I would have a caveat saying that, you know, you can only go X amount before release date. Yeah, I mean, you show, you're showing off the entire game before it even comes out, so everybody's like, oh, cool, we've already exactly. seen it. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, like, when, yeah. when Gargoyle and I did Mr. Prepper, we had a thing to where we weren't allowed to show the ending until after the game released. Yeah. Well, yeah, because you don't want to spoil I had it. to suggest that. Yeah. They yeah. were just like, no, just go ahead, go do it, just finish it. I'm like, no, you need higher sales. <laughs> if if this well, thing has four campaigns and the opening campaign, right, is, is just a tutorial, basically, I would have it so you could only do the opening campaign, the tutorial, and then the, the first campaign itself, and that's it. Like, that's it, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You wouldn't be able to do all the campaigns before it came out, but that's just me. Yeah. And it's yeah, easy to no, program I'm... that in as a soft lock. You know, you just you don't allow X, you know, items to drop or whatever it is, right? Yeah, it's and you really know they get you know they get free copies of the game, which is fine. I don't have any issue with that. Nope. But but have the soft lock on it and day of release, then you unlock it for them, and then they, they still get their free whole game. But then they're yeah, able to yes. do the rest of the content after everybody else gets the game too. Yeah. Right, they just have exactly. to uh, download it and it's fine. Right, download the patch or whatever. I mean, not that I care. I don't care that people get free games and get to show it off early. That's great. It's great for everybody. It helps everybody. The way I look at it is it's recognition for, you know, doing a great job for, you know, creator. You know, right. So yeah, I yeah. have no issues for them getting it. Yeah, no, not at all. I mean, I don't, it, it helps everybody out. Because people watch the game, they go, ooh, I want to watch more of this, so I'm going to go check out other content creators. For a content yeah. creator side of it, or for a player side, you get to see the game and go, well, I've seen enough of this, now I can make an informed decision on whether or not I want to buy it. So, whether or not I want to purchase it, yeah, on a release yeah. date, exactly. But if you've seen the whole campaign already, what's the point? What's the point? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, well, now I know everything that happens. Yeah. I'm going to go check out that windmill behind us. Windmill? Oh, check that out, yeah. It's pretty neat. I mean, if I was a hammer, I would go there. I can find a way to get it over this fence, though. Yeah, you're right. A hammer would definitely go there, I think. This whole area is fenced up. But again, yeah, no no problem with, with, with people getting the game a month early. I don't have any issue with that. It's just like... If I if I wasn't making content and I watched Raptor play through the whole game, I'd go, oh, that game looks cool. I would never buy it and play it though, because I've already no, seen I've the never. entire thing. Yeah, like, exactly. Yeah. If they did I the first really one and I went, it. oh, there's three more campaigns after this, dude. That's a lot of content, and they're not showing it, so I want to play it myself. Mm -hmm. Like I've watched other games and uh, early and not even bought them, not even done any content on them that I would have played otherwise had they not showed off the ending. Like. There's no reason to. Yeah, there's no reason to, to reason to play it yet, or make content. And it's on not it. like Minecraft where it's all open. You know what I mean? Like well, because is, you know, every everything in Minecraft thing. is different every time you load it up. So I mean, it's yeah. yeah, you can do the Minecraft. That's the reason Minecraft is still as big as it is, because there's a there's there's endless ways to play the game. So this though, eh, not so much. Just a normal week at work achievement. I don't know what this achievement is. Let me see. Let's see here, view all achievements. Normal week at work. Let's see. I think it's 40 hours in the game. Taking you for a ride, dude. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy, I got my menu up so I get, they can see it, but I can't even see that. Uh, in my screen, you're riding inside the uh, the, the drum. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> am, I, am I riding with you, seriously? Oh, look at, look at this. Look at that, we'll give you guys both these. Look at this. <laughs> I'm inside the truck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in here, help me. There we go. <laughs> uh, oh, Jimmy Hoffa, Tom Cruise can't do anything for me on this one. Right? I was literally stuck in there. That's crazy. Let me out. Get rid of these menus. There should be a hotkey to get rid of that menu right away. You know, like press F2 to get rid of menus. Something like that. Right. I mean, I think you know you're out of concrete when it stops dumping. So. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you know, it's not like I don't have this giant yellow bar or anything off on the side telling me how full I'm at. The oil rigs up here are kind of cool. You should be able to turn kits off completely and actually have them turn off completely.
And there you go. Done, done. Uh, put in beams, huh? Crane work. Yep. I'm already in here. Gargo, you want to grab the uh, the truck and help out, or do you think it'd be a waste of time, really? Uh, how many pillars are there? Uh, I mean, I'm seeing four, seven. I'm seeing seven. Ah, yeah. Yeah, I'll give you a hand. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I took off. That's I'll not good. a surprise. I'll grab on the right. I mean, grab the I got some great scenery up here, though. Seven or eight? It looks like there's eight. There's one that's invisible right here. Oh, no. I just got to grab. Okay, yeah. There's, uh... Yeah, there's seven total, it looks like. I wonder if we're going to be able to do anything with these oil rigs up here. Dude, I hope there's all kinds of DLC for this game. Like, there's no reason not to have all kinds of crazy there DLC. There's a hammer up here. At the windmill? Oh, yep, nope. I see it. Let me show everybody else. Hang on. There you go. Bone screen on the top there on the right. A little hammer up at the oil rigs and the windmills. Cool. It uh, takes you a while to get up here, though, because it's all fenced in. Oh, uh, okay. So there's only one way to get in. But yeah, I hope, dude, the, the city is huge. There's all kinds of DLC they could add to this. Oh, yeah. Oh, I would love to have a complete, here's the field, and you turn it all into, like, a residential development. Oh, I would love that. Or I mean, something, yeah. We haven't even seen Europe yet, either. Yeah, I mean, that's true. There, there's a whole campaign that, that has nothing to do with this. All different jobs and everything on the European side. So when you say there's plenty of content, there's plenty of content just for one, like the US or the European. But when you think they about both- They could have charged $55 for this game and still gotten the return on it. Oh yeah. just that much content. Yeah. That's a cool view. Yeah, there's there's a lot in this game, and again, I'm I'm kind of petty about some of the other stuff, but uh, the settings and whatnot. But and we just expect more nowadays. You know what I mean? Like, there's no reason why they couldn't have done more with the controls oh, yeah. and such. Yeah, for sure. Why is that? Oh, because you said turds. Yeah, Dang YouTube! Oh, really? Come on, YouTube. All right, so I'll go see if I can find Bone. I'm here. <laughs> yeah, where oh, are you I'm at? Right You're back. at the. Oh, are you? Okay, so you're at the top by the windmill? All right. No, I'm behind you. I know, but you were at the top of the back by the window? Uh, yeah, you have to keep going the way you're going. and then Around the fence? Yeah, there is a spot in the fence that you can get through, and then you got to climb all the way up. Okay. How long are we playing for, Tater? Uh, I don't, I don't know. I'm going to go as long as I can here. Uh, I've probably got about another 30 minutes or an hour to go before I have to take off, so. I know our original goal was 50%. We're at that right now. Yeah, and I mean, we won't be able to do this again until Friday night, probably, so, which I don't know. What is next? Is next Friday Halloween? I mean, next, uh, no, next uh, weekend. Monday's that's, that's Monday, Halloween, okay, yeah. Uh, yeah. Next weekend, I'm unavailable. Yeah, it's, uh, oh, you're unavailable next weekend? Okay, yeah, so, uh, yeah, so okay. we won't be playing it again unless, unless, no, we won't be playing again until uh, the bung gets back. Because well, I mean, it's multiplayer. I mean, that's that's fun. Of I it, mean, so. no, you guys can still play. I mean, you know, I mean, unless you yeah, guys want to go to Birmingham, Michigan, that. and you can watch the Rocky Horror Picture Show. Oh, that would actually be kind of fun. You, is it a play or is it a, yeah. a showing in a in a movie oh, set? It's a play. It's I'm a in play. It. Oh, you're it's in it, yeah. dude. Yes, yeah. I'd love to. Uh, you said Birmingham, right? It's only about two hours from me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but Birmingham, Michigan. Oh, never mind. <laughs> That's a little bit longer than two hours. <laughs> a little bit. That's about 14. All right, so I'm by the windmill here, Bone. Where was it? Uh, just keep going up to, uh, on the oil mills. Keep going up the path. Yeah, so so probably another, probably another 30, 45 minutes to an hour, something like that, Tater. Um, All depends on how fast this is going. Yeah, I mean, I mean if, right we, now, if, if we get to 80%, then... Yeah, if we get to 80% on this, I'll just go ahead and finish it today. So... Um, can you make a suggestion about the large cattle? Uh, shoot, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm listening. And add horns. I mean, that's yeah. No, I don't. Know. Yeah. Seems that reasonable. My suggestion. Make them spot it. Yeah, I'm listening. Shoot, let's hear. It. Oh, there we go. Uh, I see the hammer. By the old donkey. 
It's, and it's just easier just to fast travel back. Instead uh, of walking all what is back. that I need? I need one more framework. wood ceiling element. And then and one, one pallet, pallet of wood. wood. And a pallet of concrete. Yeah, that one right there. The frame yeah, that's, that's what I was missing. I was like, what am, what am I missing here? Why does it go way out like that? What are you doing? Well, because you need something else. You need a rebar, and it looks like wood on here. Yeah, over on the concrete slab. Yeah. Yep. I can't wait. unpack anything until everything so it's all put into place. Down, okay. This is the part of multiplayer I don't like. Yeah, because we could be doing other stuff while this is going on. Uh, is it a pallet yeah. of wood or is it one buzz? Um, it says a pallet buzz. of wood. Uh, yeah, but yeah, let me just take a look at it. It, it is. It, well, it's. Oh, there's two of them need, here. You uh, still need one wood ceiling. Yeah, I've got it right here. So this is. I got four by fours here and one by sixes over here. Yeah, which would be one wood ceiling and one pallet wood. Yeah. So he's got the, um, the one by sixes, I think. Yep. So then uh, it's his other pallet. This should be the ceiling done. Yeah, so now we just need the pallet of wood one by sixes. Yep. There's one right at the foot of the crane. I don't know. Uh, you should be able to reach it. Make the cons fair. I don't know what I don't know what that word is. Does it mean uh, for the food to be bigger? I don't I don't know what that okay. means either. I don't I don't Make know what you're constipated. I think that's what she's. That's what it looks like. Constipated. Um, but I'm sure that's not it. Uh, I, I don't. Mean, I don't know if you'd want your cattle to be constipated. Yeah. So which one do I need? I don't need the one buys, right? I need the other one. You need the one I'm standing by. The one right underneath the crane. Or that, that one too. Wait, there's one underneath the crane? Yeah, there's yeah. one that's yeah, real close to the base of the crane. Wow, yeah, it looks like you, you grabbed going? it. I'm pulling back. Stop going out. Dang it. <laughs> Literally pulling back on the thing and it keeps going forward. No, no, backwards. Yeah, and drops at the same time and lowers the... Yeah, I had that happen while yeah. I go with the excavator too. Like I was trying to, I was trying to, or the bulldozer, sorry. I was trying to turn... Uh, I was trying to just back up, and then it started going forward on one track, and I'm like, I'm pulling both of the the buttons, the bumpers. It should be going backwards. All right, we got Oop, pillars. No, we got some pillars. Get out of the way. <laughs> the bone unpack. There. Oh wow, we don't even have to unpack. Oh, that's about right. Make it where it holds more food. I mean, it holds a lot of food, but if we're skipping night a lot, then it's going to go through the food. Also, we have a lot of cows, so. Uh, but I mean, uh, we're we we're a little. The pumper truck, aren't we? Yeah, we uh, are. I'm already in it. Yeah, we're we're a little late in the series for that. Um. We can just keep them alive and keep them producing milk until next Friday. We'll be good. But yeah, uh, Celtic Moose. So the side of the cow pen, like the when they're outside, the the other side of that from the building, is where you dump the uh, dump the stuff at, and you can only dump it in one of the three slots. So if you have silage, it'll only let you dump in the silage slot. Uh, but it's all in the barn right there next to the cows. That's all you got to do is just go grab a trailer, fill it up, go dump, and then put it back in the back in the barn, and then grab straw and then grab hay. So they're they're not those, doing it that way is not hard. If we if we had to mix it ourselves, it'd be a little more complicated. But that thing feeds them. It'll make the make the TMR itself and feed them. So all right, poor walls. Yeah, we're getting in position. Poor walls. Uh, I'm just going to go up here and watch. Yeah, you can take a break now. Yeah. All right, let's get everybody's view here. Oh, my view is kind of boring. Boring. Whoa. 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 <laughs> you guys having a sword fight there or what? Yeah, I was... <laughs> We were dueling. Yeah, I was gonna. I was dropping down so I could. I could. Uh, I could get a closer view. Carbol moved right, but I was like, "Oh God!" Okay. Which way are you going, Gargoyle? Backwards. Just gonna go there. Okay. Yeah, backwards. Now. I just know I don't want to be in your way, but I'm trying to. I'm like I'm out away from you. I think so. Oh, where'd you go? I gotta be. Careful ah. on how I do this because, hey, yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave that close area. I've unpacked too far. Oh, okay. I 
I'm trying to stay out of your way here. I'm trying to stay inside or outside of you, so. Yeah, it's all good. Try to give us a different different view of the whole situation. Oh, we didn't even have to harvest sugar. I was going to plow the sugar cane and fill it up, but that works. If it's grown and ready to harvest, I guess. Fine. Yeah, let's see if I'm getting anything in here. It says I am, but at the same time, it's not showing it. Oh, it's full. Oh, it's There's okay. a shadow, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I just realized it too. I was like, how come that's not going in? And then I saw like just that bit of the edge there where the sun was. Yeah. Okay, now I'm confused on my camera operation here. There we go. Which way are you going to, sir? Uh, back corner. Corner. Okay. Like you're hung up on the beam again. Yep. There you go. Yeah, who put the beams in the way? I don't know. You think you would do the uh, the concrete pour first, right? And what's the structural? But... Uh, that's fully extended. Dang it. All right, I'll go over to the other side then. You tell me we're gonna have to move again? Yep. Maybe. Getting there though. We've done this yeah. a few times. Over halfway done. Small mall, that's all I know, too. Yeah. yeah. This is like three outlet stores right here. Yeah. <laughs> but hey, man, if they didn't have anything in the area, that's better than nothing, so. Can't get that one knuckle to suck back in, eh? Every time. All right, reset. Oh, Second okay. bone. <laughs> Are you repositioning yeah. or? Yeah, I got to reposition. Okay. Oh, because of that uh, that last knuckle. Yep, that last yeah. knuckle. Once you go too far with it, that's it. You cannot bring it back in. You can. It just takes a little bit of. Okay, I don't know where you went. You just went forward, didn't you? No. Yeah. Which way are you going with it, Gargle? Go uh, do that I'm other side go first. The far, yeah, far end first, and then I'll go back to where we were just parked. Okay. If I can get around.
cool. 88% done. Give as many views as possible for this. When I just ran out. Nice. All right, unpack. Now you can unpack, Bone. <laughs> now you can do the unpacking. I'm out of here. No, not that one. See what it does when you when you unpack everything. I mean, this is. I mean, oh, it's building walls. This is not where you put the stuff. No, nowhere close. But that's what our helper on on uh, on okay, sites okay. for, though. Mm. All right, cool. Crane work. Yep. All right, let me park the concrete truck here. Yeah, we only have a couple of vehicles here. Just a few. <laughs> Just a few. Not many. Yeah, having that crane speed movement increased is nice, but man, when it starts going, it really starts going. <laughs> it, yeah. it goes, it whips, yeah. I'll grab the small ones if you want to grab the long ones there. Right? Yep. That was good. So one thing I'm noticing is that there's no like elevator shaft. No second floor. I'm telling you, this is like a, this is like an outlet room. mall with like three or four stores in it, if I had to guess. What it looks like anyway. They're probably going to throw a restaurant in here. And then, yeah, uh, a, a store. Here, I'll go down so you can go up. Oh, I'm going over you. You're good. Which one are you doing first? Okay. Yeah, well, he's got all the small pieces and you're doing all the big pieces, right? So. Right. I was I was working back toward him that way I could try to stay out of his way, so I just needed to know which way, which direction we were headed there. Oh, going, I, I yeah. see how it's going too because it's, yep. it's kind of a puzzle up there. Yep. Oh, straight seams. Yeah. That's all. Whoa, easy now. Move my stuff around. Yeah, I saw that. That was crazy. Pretty neat though. There's a there's an element of of kind of thought there where you have to be careful what you're what you're moving around. So, hey, guess what, guys? It's nighttime. It, it I mean, shocker. <laughs> like it's always I mean, nighttime. It was it was daytime for the concrete. All the concrete work was done in the daytime. Like a glove. Oh, I should have hopped on one of the beans. Ah, oh, dang it, missed opportunity. Okay, we got uh, pillars to put in over here now. I have these going over here. Three of them, where are they at? They lay next to me. three, so yeah. I'll just don't bother. Yep. With the big guy. Oh, 
<laughs> I can't believe I got that to fit. <laughs> Are you in the lines? Yeah, well, 99% within the lines, yeah. He's close enough he did climb back in through the window if I was parking next to him. And did it again. Went to change modes and it jumped me out. I really do not like that radial menu. Yeah, so apparently you can you can hotkey that now. What? You can just have yeah, because you can keybind now. You can just have single yep. buttons to do things. So. Oh. Like you can still oh, use the radio wheel, nice. but yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Oh, dang! I thought you were gonna hang on there for a minute. I thought you were gonna get it. Yeah. Hello? Oh, there we go. <laughs> it was Bye. sticking on the ground. Oh, there's somebody in the way. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know who that could have been. Both of us, yeah. Oh, unpack again. Uh, where's this stuff at? Up top, over here. Oh no, it's, that's the bottom. Yeah. There must be some stairs or something about to go in. There's yeah, gotta be in order to get to that mezzanine. Yep. Yeah, yeah they are. I just built. Yep. I just built stairs. Okay, prefabbed walls. Uh, where are they situated at? I do not see any. Uh, is that going to be a truck and trailer load? More than likely. All right, I'll see if we need any more concrete work done. If not, I'll get rid of the, all the concrete stuff. Yeah, I don't see them anywhere. I just spun around with the... Yeah, they're not out here. Yeah, prefabricated walls, multi-trailer. Yeah. 16 of them, though. That could be a couple loads. It could be. Where do we go for that? The industrial area, uh, prefabricated walls. Yep. Yep. I am not seeing any more concrete work, so I will get rid of the concrete. Okay. Uh, somebody get in the truck and trailer. I'm on it. Okay. I will meet you at the free pre the the free pabbed wall place. You'll meet me at the pool hall. Yeah. Oh, it was trying to take the take the crane with me. It was trying to fast travel the crane over there. I don't want to do that. I just want to take myself. <laughs> That'd be unique. It'd be you weird. Take the, uh, you're at the prefab place. Prefabbed. Okay. 16 of them that'd be if it's four per crate and you can get two crates on there then it's going to be two trips if nothing else right yeah let me know when you're in position there I am mostly in position. Okay, let's see if it'll do it. Uh, it just says purchase. Load packages. Okay, here we go. So if you want to get the far right hand oh, side, hang on. There, uh, Deuce, I'll try to grab the uh, inner areas here. Oh, not available. Okay, yeah, so it's going to be two trips. All right. You fast traveling with me? Uh, No, I'm just going to jump back over there. Yeah, I'll just fast travel back over. Well, I know you're gonna fast travel with me. You could have jumped in his truck and went for a free ride. Yeah, could have, but didn't. And also, just drive ahead there, Bone. I feel like Locker. on a construction site like this, there'd be a lot more lights. All yeah. right, so should we just undo these, like take them off the back of his truck, and then have him go grab the other ones? Probably, yeah. All right. So leave them locked. Okay, I'm clear to fast travel. Could uh, be. Yes. All right, I'll unpack those for us there, Deuce. Okay. Ooh, I can yep. just go in the store, right, and have them to load me, right? Yeah, once you get pulled into the spot you need, walk over to the front and hold Y, and, it, and it'll give a... should give you the jobs thing, and then... It's not Y for me. Well, whatever. 
Yeah. Whatever button it is for keyboard, keyboard. users. Yeah. Oh god, going the wrong way. I gotta figure out where I'm going to with this now. This one. Go. Okay, let's see, I got another one of the same here. But where? Over there. Okay. Over here to this side with it. Am I unpacking? How many more loads do you think we need? That's it. I got everything. Oh, yeah, then yeah, that's the last one. Then yeah, definitely. Oh, I'm on yours. Like, what's going on here? I'm Bones not, sitting there with the other ones confused me. Yeah. Well, you can grab them. I, I unlocked them. Okay, cool. <laughs> and uh, whoa, come back here. To the other end, though. That Which doesn't need anything. It's fun. We will. We still have. We still have quite a bit of stuff in the material drop-off area too. That'll probably be the interior walls. Probably that'll be the one where um, our helper does there's, things. There's concrete stuff there, though. Oh, I'm at max extension here. Please tell me I can get in there. Yes, okay. Whew. Yeah, that's about all I can do. Everything else is all bigger grain work. No, you can I get all stuff reach. close to you. No, no, I, I can't reach to where they need to go in the site. You just gotta grab the right pieces. But it's hard to know what pieces you're grabbing. Yeah, but I've, I've fully extended out. So that's my, that's my issue. Crane ain't got no more rat reach. I gotta say, still my favorite build we've done so far was the bridge. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah, that was that was a decent one to do. Well, I mean, just because it was so well, the Ferris wheel. I mean, both of those are really unique. So, pretty neat. The Ferris neat. wheel though was solid. It was solid crane work. There wasn't much that the other people could do really. Right. The bridge, I mean, when, when you and I did the bridge, we both stayed fairly busy. Pretty much the whole time, yeah. So. I mean, because we each had cranes. We were on both sides of the, of the, of the water, you know. Um, and then for the, like, the, the, the big paving, I mean, it, it was big enough to where both of us could stay busy constantly going on it right yeah i mean that's that's so kind that's of part of the like fun is yeah is is i mean there's gonna be dead time right there's gonna be dead time sometimes so yeah. but for the most part <laughs> it is just a lot of standing around not some dead time there's a lot of dead time yeah have a whole new appreciation for those guys standing around on the construction sites. My taxpayers' dollars hard at work. Right. See, now you know why you just, whenever you go by a construction site, you see a bunch of people standing around. They're waiting for their, to do their job. Yeah, I won't make fun of them too much anymore. I will, but I mean, it's not to their faces. <laughs> those guys work hard. They got big muscles. I mean, not only that, but it is it isn't their fault. They're just standing there, you yeah, know. Exactly. Like, they're they're wait they're waiting on their 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 time, like Bone said. So. Yeah, the hurry up and wait ordeal, unfortunately. Yep. Fall mall pieces. Woohoo! 
I'm slinging them, man. I'm trying. I'm, I'm going as fast as I can go here. No, you're, you're going as fast as the game allows. We can modify it, though. We can make it go faster. I mean, you could always just skip task, but what's the fun in that? Yeah, there's exactly. no fun in that at all. Uh, so something I do hope they do um, is something similar to American Truck Sim or Farm Sim is open it up to the modding community. I hope so. The uh, other ones were, from what I understand, it's just this one, they have not opened it up yet. I think, honestly, though, in the world of modding, I think for games like this should be allowed to get at least one DLC out before they open it to the modding community. That way they can, you know, get as much returns on their investment as they can. Because whatever, you know, they can come up with for DLC, somebody else would already have modded that in the game if modding was open. Maybe, maybe not, though. You know, I mean, oh. at some point, yeah, but yeah, you're, you're probably right. But at the same time, like, the core game itself still needs content, you know? Yes. Like, yes. they still need that. Like, they could expand the, the city up there where we put the UFO at the very beginning. We haven't even been back up there yet, so. No. Like, that could be built into the story, you know? There's still things I mean, they can I do, for I sure. I would have built the mall near it. Yeah, because there is nothing at the village. The little diners next to it, that's about it. So yeah, the village definitely needs more. I wonder if my brother put the bag over the air conditioner. Because that entire thing that slumped down would have hit right onto the air conditioner. Ooh. I'll have to check that after we're done streaming. So there's some more stuff over here. All right, unpack. Uh, I'll move the truck. Yep. I'm just going to send it home. Uh, are we going to be needing it again for any more? Probably, yeah. There was there was lots of these uh, prefab things. Or that may have been it. It may have just been 16 of those is what yeah. I was seeing. Maybe. All right, cool. Ciller ceiling element wooden frames. Yep, five of those to put in. All right, yeah, yeah. And yeah, not much space in there for the mobile. And down and up. Bones going with us. <laughs> that, was weird. I didn't that was weird uh, when I dropped it you look like you're gonna fall through and then you just teleport it over with it well now I can get back inside I can jump through a window maybe My boots are dirty, though. I'm leaving all muddy footprints on your nice, clean wood here. Come on, man. All the sound effects that they have in game is just awesome. Oh, yeah, for sure. And that's that's Again, another... Lots, like, of, lots of really good things. Yeah, there's so many good things about the game. I just hate that they're they're missing kind of that... We, we, we're gamers, too, and we understand the player element of it. You know, what makes sense. So what, what, is, what is industry standard kind of deal, you know? Like I said, the only thing I think is that, you know, they're just missing somebody who went to uh, university for game de uh, game development. Right. More. Ooh, uh, nope, that's going to be out of my reach. Okay. Where no are problem. you going? Oh, I'm, uh, no, I'm the yeah, far apart. Right. Yeah. Dang it. Just trying to make things quicker, but eh, sometimes you just can't do it all. Yeah, no, it's all good. I mean, if we could be able to set up multiple cranes, that'd be nice. That'd be nice. That'd be nice if we could have like a three, three crane, uh, three cranes per site, like three different areas, zones that you could put them in. Even Oi. two. Oh, <laughs> uh, watching you guys swing around is pretty funny. And I'm just good. Oh, there we go. Reset me.
Here, we'll balance the board for him. They're both. Okay. <laughs> Balance it out, fellas. We're about to go. Oh, we must have balanced it pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Looking good, looking good. I think you're about 10 pounds heavier than me, though. <laughs> Yeah, there. it wasn't as close to the edge as you were. When we were at the 50% mark earlier, I thought, man, we'll be at 75% in no time. No. No, not the case. Almost. Almost. Not, not quite. We're getting there, though. On like 15% is the talking to the guy at the very end, isn't it? Yeah, it's usually a, a good 10% right there. How many more steps do we have? Uh, let me take a look at the job. Uh, two more after this. Wood bearing structure, which has one, two, three, oh, a bunch of unpacking. Oh, yeah, yeah, so one uh, wood components, materials delivery, timber floor. Six more roof. And then roof construction is a bunch more prefabricated. Well, that's kind of what we're doing now, right? There's Company. a bunch of roof construction here. Yeah. Like, we the still got a whole other bone. section to go after this one. crane and give you a hand for this part. It's close enough. Yeah, I was about to say this one and the neck. There's probably a whole other section to do after this the way that looks. So. I'll go for the inside. You want to take that last outside? Yep. I'm surprised that all the buildings have flat roofs here. So close and yet so far. Yeah, it's kind of weird, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Like I mean, flat just roof the houses. Buildings. Yeah. Um, we're the only ones that didn't really. I got you. I was just seeing where you were at there. I'll get. I was getting out of your way. And again, I'm guessing we're gonna have to do it again because it looks like there's gonna be more right past that. So. Oh, I gotta clear the mark area. Okay. Oh, you got a foot in it. But yeah, I mean, you you having that thing out on the next one too is probably gonna be handy. Yep. Yep. One yep. more time. I had to move back literally a foot, so yep. I wasn't. <laughs> so your foot wasn't in it. Oh, sorry. Nope, you're good. Get my out of the way. Help me out. Just not let me on that second stack. There we go. I mean, Deuce has been giving me a ride. Let's let's go for a ride with Gargle. There you go. Why not? Yeah. He's got a little bit more swing in his uh, crane. 
Yeah, but uh, I have to extend out and everything else where Deuce does not. Oh, I know. I mean, technically I do. It's just not telescoping. It's just moving the, the hook out. Right where it's supposed to be. Cool. Hey, look at that. Trust us. All right. Move some uh, wood. It okay. should be everything left. Two, two, one. Is there five packages over there? There is. Well, you have one. You have a pallet of wood right by the crane. Yeah. You have two things of wood beams over here. You have two pallets of wood over here. Yeah. So yeah, everything is still right there. Wait, what are these right here? Oh, well, those are prefabs. So we'll have to get those picked up. Oh, okay. Maybe. Package of ceiling element, wooden big frame, and package roof element. Come on, let me unpack it. Not yet. You gotta get them all over there first. One step at a time. What you get? I get it, but at the same time, it's like, man, come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> yeah. yeah. As soon as the crane operator would drop stuff, you know those a crew would be on it. Exactly. They'd be popping the bands and you know, swinging hammers. Hey, afternoon, Hawkeye. I mean, as long as they're not as long as they're not directly under them, right? Like. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. What's up, Hawkeye? How's it going? Yep. I go up. Oh god. Damage in the material. That's fine. <laughs> it's it's packaged well. Yep. It's well packaged. It's got plenty of padding around it. It's all good. Yeah. I mean it's only wood hitting iron. What's the worst that could happen, right? End up with a splinter. It's, I mean, it's not like iron is designed to do any damage to wood. But wasn't that the whole reason for iron to begin with? Yeah. Swing, better, 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 swing. Like for advancement in, in battles? But using wooden shields, they were like, hey, we got this new thing we can make, and it's harder well, than I wood. Mean, you had the, the Bronze Age, and then... <laughs> wooden so. swords just didn't last up against the uh, bronze. I mean, bronze was not that much stronger than wood. No. But it did uh, drop trees faster. It helped... I, I mean, the armor was good. It helped a lot with that. Oh, seriously, I cleared the area. Let me go in there, and now I can unpack. Unpack construction materials. We do have to deliver wood components. So I gotta get the truck back out? I think so, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it. I mean, when I went to the store, I didn't see anything else there, though. But we well, weren't but that to that step wood. yet. This is the wood. That would you be up to put sawmill. Saw. Yeah, you have to put up the sawmills. One, I think. Me, yep. Okay. Oh, what the? I got him. Where's the sawmill at? It'd oh, be oh. the all the way west. Looks like a table saw, buzz saw. Oh, type yeah, yeah. Okay. Up. Okay. Yeah, I purchased them. You just got to accept them. Unless you're going to do it by yourself. Got a what? Just go ahead and buy them. Oh. Because it's probably timed out by now. I bought them. You just need, I needed exception. Yep. Gotcha. They are purchased. I'll go, and, I'll go up and get them. Is this another one where you can load from the store or whatever? I uh, should be. Yeah, I don't think I've ever been actually, uh, actually been up here. Uh, nope. There is no load from the store. It's just sitting out here. Oh, they are? Yep. 
Uh, let me know if you're going to need the help with the mobile crane. Probably going to need the mobile crane. Yeah. Well, maybe. I don't see... Yeah, there's no crane thing here anywhere. Well, I have a truck with a crane, remember? Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, never mind. I forgot we had the crane truck. Best thing ever in construction right there. Uh, these are kind of big, though. Yeah, let me know if you need it. They are very large, yeah. Could you have purchased and sent to the side, or was it you had to pick them up? Uh, this was... Uh, I, the, uh, all the prefab stuff, you can't send to the site. You gotta, uh, okay. You gotta deliver. You can't... Yeah, you gotta transport. You cannot uh, have it delivered. Sorry. Right. Yeah, um, hopefully I can grab both of these at once. I don't know. Oh, there's three packages, so... Yeah, two of them are quite large. Cargo is too heavy. All right. I'm not gonna. Well, that's new. That's the first time I've seen that. So, let me know if I gotta move. No, you should be alright. Yeah, that's the first time I've seen that. Cargo too heavy. Is that gonna fit on there? And that's just one of them. That's not even both of them. There's two of those. No, they're side by side. Oh, I see now. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's crazy. What's up, Jeremy? How's it going, buddy? Jeremy! How you doing, man? Hey, watch the paint job on Deuce's truck. Yeah, right? Happy oh. snow day, dude. Uh, can you stack the other one now? That's gonna be the question. I'm hoping I can stack this one and then maybe put those trusses on top of that, even. Yeah, because I don't think there's, I don't think there's enough room back here for them. There might be, but no. No, they'd have to go on top. You you missed you missed a few items that you could have hit with that. That's right. Uh, all right, cool. Buses, hopefully. Please, oh please, oh please, oh please, oh please. No, not getting any highlights. Well, you're not even close to it yet. Yeah, go down some. Yeah, just set it down right there. Yeah, just put it on there. Let's see what happens. No, it won't even let me release. Oh, try the back back here then. If you can turn it sideways, set it at the back maybe. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yep. Okay. I mean, maybe. I don't. I don't know. I doubt it'll do that, but because it's, it's way we wider need a line than the trailer. Sign if we're doing it this way. Yeah. It's way wider than the truck is. Nope. Not right, looking like it. Right one. Okay. okay, we'll hop back down there where I can unload him. Alright, and then I'll come back up. Yep. I'll just get everything positioned so you can just hop in and drive in and I'll set it down. I'm on my way, Bone. On my way. I figure if I park right here, it'll be easier for you. Yeah, just swing it straight around, drop it. Yep. Uh, hello, go out. Oh my God. There we go. Single, to single input the things to get us up to date. There we go. Now I can see you guys at the site. We were just, just starting to load stuff. <laughs> I wonder why YouTube does that. I haven't had that problem with Twitch. Where every once in a while you got to refresh the the stream in order to be um, at the lowest latency. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, I can't unload this. No, no it's, it's not. not giving, it's not coupled or anything. It's not giving me the hookup. I'm right uh, on it right there. No, it can't be. You have the biggest crane, right? The heaviest crane. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it specifically states we need the mobile crane, and I'm wondering if that's why. Like, maybe it specifically makes you do this with the mobile crane. But, yeah, I'm right on the hookup. Pretty sure. Yeah, maybe there, you can't take them as a stack. Maybe you have to take them as individuals. Okay. 
All right, well, I'll just set this off to the side and uh, come on over there and... Well, that's just silly. Yeah. Unless they, um... So you probably can't take it as a package, but you can probably take the individual pieces. Uh, they might have bugged out, but I'm not, I'm not seeing where they bugged out, though. Right? No, the hook thing's there. It just won't let me... It just wouldn't grab, yeah. Yeah, it wouldn't oh, turn right. green for me. I don't even see the hook. No, you won't unless you're actually in a crane. Or something that'll pick it up, anyway. Yep, that's what it was. That's stupid. Yeah, this this tower crane right here is the heavy duty tower crane. It should definitely be able to pick it up. Yeah, because I I'm wondering if I can pick up. I should be able to pick up the the truss. The truss, yeah, you should be able to. It looks uh, like just standard truss. Those are the truss. Uh, the island of where we were just at. Oh, you moved them? Well, I had to. I had them on my my crane. I didn't want to leave him right where you're driving. That doesn't stop me. <laughs> True enough. <laughs> Those do look heavy, man. Package of ceiling element wooden frame big. Okay. Yeah, that's the... Big is right. Oh, what is that one package of wood right there? Where does that go? That's for the trusses. No, no, that, that right. uh, one package you just drove past there. Yeah, Wait. I know, the one that's real close to your base. Yeah. Yeah, it's been there for a while. That's the one that Bone and I were like, oh, you got to pick yeah. this one up. <laughs> but well, it, we haven't it, moved it, it yet. It didn't though. do anything. Okay. Yeah. No, you set it down there, just it hasn't been used for anything yet. That was one of the first packages that got put into place. Uh, so it's okay. either glitched out or it... Uh, it needs to get used later on. My guess is it'll probably get used later. Maybe it's for the sidewalk. That's very possible, yeah. Alright, I was able to use my crane for this one, but... Nice. Lurch! Did you say lurch? You said urch. Oh. Hey, somebody was telling me that they're coming out with a new Adams Family type show or something on Netflix. It's animated. Oh, is it? Yeah. Dang it. I mean, dude, there's so many shows coming back. Like, yeah, because they can't think of any original ideas anymore. Right. I'm pretty excited about Hocus Pocus, too. I'm not gonna lie. That's already out, isn't it? It is. Yeah, I haven't watched it yet, though. Pretty excited about it, though. To be honest, and... I don't know if I ever watched the first one or not. Yeah, I won't be able to help you out there, Deuce, otherwise, because I'll be smacking into the crane trying to go back Yeah, all good. Work. All good. Only 10 pieces. I'm glad they put these, they made us put these on the other side of where they should be to make them close to grab, you know? Yeah. That would have made too much sense. Gotta go yeah, all the way around here to grab them. Just so. nothing but roof pieces. Yep. Oh, Gargo, can you pull in right there behind that stack and grab these? Yeah, I don't have the extension on that crane to get all the way over there. Oh, that's true. You know what we should try? We should try that big, the big, the big crane. See how big it is. See how far it actually extends out. The big mobile crane. I was able to do uh, quite a bit of the bridge. I'm like, you know where you have to go from one side to the, then to the other? Yeah. Yeah, I was able to do quite a bit once, of it. Once you move down to the next sections, the mobile crane will be used again. It'll, you'll have room. Uh, it's just right here. You'd be you'd be you'd be getting in the Smacking way too into much. The crane. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Smacking in the scaffolding of the crane. Easy. Sorry. Oh my God, where are you going? I let off of it and just keep swinging. I mean, it's got to be four to six inches thick, probably eight inches, maybe. It's yeah, it's probably eight. I mean, it's that's some heavy-duty stuff right there, man. I can't remember what the heck they call these things there. It just looks like press wood, though. 
it's wood with a like OB or OSB um, surrounding uh, styrofoam. Oh it's yeah, for acoustics and all that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh no, when he flips it up though, it's it just looks hollow. Like it's just yeah, it looks hollow. It just looks like it's just framed with the o OSB around it. Here in Canada, that wouldn't do. You need to have the uh, the insulation. Well, depending on what, this looks like it's it's fairly tropical. So, yeah, yeah. I, I would say. I mean, a lot of people are saying this is California. I mean, well, I, I I don't know about California. I mean, it's definitely a coastal town or coastal mm -hmm. area. But uh, I was thinking like more Arizona. Um, but I mean, either way, it's. I mean, because California is too built up. Yeah. So. Well. Hmm. Yeah, I can't really place it because, you know, having the ocean off to the side, I mean, that could be one of the Great Lakes, I guess. But, I mean, we, they are saying that we're supposed to get seasons. Yeah, it's a panel, but there's there's something. There, it's like a styrofoam-filled panel or something like that. Like, there's. Yeah. Um, can't remember the actual proper terms for it. Uh my uncle built his house and it had all the preformed panels that had all the styrofoam and everything else put into it. So. Change bump you a bit here. Concrete form, foam, foam board or something like that? I can't remember. Yeah, I have no idea. I'm not even. Yeah, I'm not even gonna try because I don't. I have no clue what it would be. Well, when we were looking at building a house and everything else, we went through and you know, we took a look at like 16 different ways you could build homes, and in the end, the one that looked the best, you know, for us would be you know something that's gonna last forever. <laughs> so that's why we went with the Millennium Home. Barn Dominium. That's that's me and Miss Deuce have already decided if we ever build one, we're just gonna have a Barn Dominium built. Cheaper. It's all metal. Still do your two by four framing just for your sheetrock and walls and stuff on the interior. Yeah, your but... interiors, yeah, yep. your interiors. You don't need to worry about uh, load bearing frame walls or anything How like that. How hot would it get though in there? Um, probably well, no different just... than anything yeah, else. Just, yeah, it's insulated ceiling, right? So it doesn't yeah. really matter. It's not like you're just. It's not like one of those pole barns where it's just you know sheet metal just getting blazed down. So you're cooking like a solar oven on the inside. Right. Yeah. I mean, it's. You still do it like you've still got all sheetrock interior all the way through. It's so. it's still conventional home building, just instead of using you know mostly um, concrete or or structural uh, wood forms. Instead, you're using just metal for all your your structural parts. Right, and then you do tin roof um, or metal roof, and then uh, they have metal exterior too, which is probably yeah. what would go with just to make it just to make it easy. But they have. 35 different colors to choose from uh if you chose oh. not to do that you could do um like the concrete board or whatever it is whatever it's yeah. i can't remember the name of it you could do that in different colors you can actually just do brick paneling like it's it's brick looking metal paneling so there's like a hundred different options you can do for it what are we doing unpacking okay. yeah unpacking uh, oh i see him yeah, now i was gonna say what I are we went to an area that doesn't have a door <laughs> Bone stuck. Okay, Where's the door at? <laughs> it will not let me unpack. It didn't say that. Uh, uh, that come this way, Bone. Come toward the crane. Me. Yeah, the camera's doing all kinds of fun things. Yeah, you're right, right there. There you go. Uh -huh. yeah, and through here. You like, even I here saw it from up these, here. Because I can't unpack. It didn't check off for me. Uh, it doesn't have the blue dots. Yeah, I got three blue dots, but I can't do anything with them. You guys can't unpack this? All right, hang on a minute. Nope. And we'll let Deuce I unpack blue, one, and that should kick our... Uh, it won't let me unpack them either. Oh, there we go. I got it. Okay. Cool. Yeah, for me, it's not saying. It's saying that we still have 10 of 10 wooden frames. Put it up. All right, here goes more. Clear the area. You gonna try the truck again, Gargle? I really want to see that big one in action. You want me to buy one of the big ones? Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, I think we got booted. I think we did too. 
Connection to the running multiplayer game has been lost. Man, yep. that's what I thought when nothing was updating for me. All, All right. right, well, we made it 75%. I think that's probably good for the day. I need to call it there anyway. I got some other stuff I got to do. Yeah, I mean, I got to go do some actual construction time. around the house. So that was a good day. <laughs> All right, got lots done. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that was a good that was a good build though. I like that. I like it. So there's a lot of variation there. It's a lot of crane work, but there's a lot of other stuff happening too. So that's pretty neat. Yeah, hopefully the save is uh, recent. Maybe so. So uh, I don't know how much we lost. Scenario, you'll have to go back and unpack because it always saves after you finish something. Oh, that's so true. After you did those ten of ten wooden panels, the worst thing would be was like, oh, you have to unpack. That's all. Yep. Yep. Sounds good. Well, all right, fellas, I enjoyed it. Well, thanks for having us. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I appreciate you guys joining. All the awesome peoples in chat, thank you for joining us today. That was awesome. Thank you for your keeping us going. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I appreciate everybody being here, and I, I hope you guys enjoy Construction Sim. I plan on keeping it going. It's just we're going to be spread out a little bit because we're doing it on the weekends. So depending on you know when we're available and when who's available and that kind of stuff, if 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 neither Bone or Gargoyle is available, I'll probably just wait until one or, one or the other or both are available. So uh, I think I'm available this Halloween weekend coming up, but the weekend after that, I think I got Caveman. So okay, that'd be me and you this weekend coming up, and then you and Bone the next weekend after. So the the 29th, me and you. Yep, sounds good. Um, or you said you had him Halloween weekend. No, no, no. I got him the weekend after. The weekend after. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah so that sounds good. So, Bone, you're not available next weekend. So, me and Gargoyle will no, jump back in all. and yep. probably finish this up. Um, but uh, other than that, uh, I'll continue my, my regular scheduled programs on Monday. We'll be doing more, probably more Stranded Alien Dawn. Uh, just because I'm really starting to figure the game out. And I'm really enjoying it, so... Uh, and don't forget, next Friday is our finale on the community server, and then the Friday after that, we'll be starting a whole new server. We're going to do multiple farms, so I'm going to have the More Farms mod on. Uh, I'm going to put a poll out in Discord today on how many people from console would be interested in playing. Uh, and if we have enough, I'll put up a second server that's identical with the, with the same mods, minus the, the ones that are modded for PC only. Uh, the same mods on that server set up the exact same way. We'll just run two servers. We're on one crossplay and one uh, that's super OP PC play. So, um, nice. But uh, I've never actually tried to do that, so we may do that. And uh, if we have enough interest, if it's only one or two people, it's it's going to cost me some money to do it. So it's not it's not really worth doing it for one or two people. But we got to have enough people on console that want to do it. So. Uh, if not, then... I, I, I do have a question for you, though. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What you got? When do you plan on starting Victoria? Uh, it's, I'm interested in that one. It comes out on the 27th or the 25th. What is it? It's on my. It's already on my Nexus. If you guys want to pre-order Victoria 3, you can already go do it. Uh, I'm looking now to see when this comes out. Uh, Tuesday would be uh, about right. 25th. Yeah, so Tuesday. That That's when I'm going to play Victoria. So okay. <laughs> I, I was waiting on release day for it. So I, I, I almost didn't even show any interest in it because it looks too complicated for me. But then I thought, oh, it's, it's major complicated. That's fine. We'll figure it out. So <laughs> uh, according to some people, I should put hours into the game before I ever make content on it. That way I know what's going on and I can I can be more helpful to everybody else. That's not the way this works, people. That's not the way <laughs> my on, channel works. That's on part two and three. Yeah, that's not the way it works. Trial by fire. Yeah. I, I literally load the game up, never played it, and start playing and figure it out as I go. That's how I do things. Well, that and considering you never played Victoria 1 or 2, that's going to be interesting. Consider I've never heard of it. It's definitely going to be interesting. So Yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> it's definitely going to be interesting. But if you if you are a fan of, what is it, a colony builder? What is it? Like, I don't even know what it is. Uh, it's a city builder type game. Um, a lot of city management stuff, only it's done in the Victorian ages. Cool. Okay. So, so if you like city builders and you like that kind of city builder, go check it out on Steam. But if you want to buy the game, you can help me out, and I get a little, I get a little uh, commission off of it if you buy it from my Nexus store, which you can find the link down below. So go check that out if you're looking to pick up a new city builder uh, or any, a, a, a number three Victoria number three, because uh, apparently there was a one and it. two. I had no idea. Yeah, uh, I would recommend buying it. It's yeah, a so, great series. So there you go. Yeah. Uh, I'm looking forward to trying it out because, again, I've never really played a whole lot of city builders. I'm getting back into them, uh, and I'm ha I'm enjoying them. I'm enjoying the, the more I play, the more I feel like I'm, I'm figuring stuff out quicker in the city builders because it's 
a lot of the same thought process for some of it, but this one looks totally yep. different. This one looks totally different. It looks way more complicated, so I'm interested to try it. So, uh, But links down below for everybody. Bone, Gargles, links both down below. Uh, Nexus store down below. Check out my other channels, too. I play Dinkum on Wednesdays and Sundays. You can go check that channel out. And all my farm sub stuff that I stream on Twitch gets uploaded to Farm Reduce. That link's down below as well. I have a lot of channels and a lot of different stuff going on. Feel free to go check it all out. I appreciate you guys. Thank you guys for joining again. Not a problem. Hey, he was glad to be here. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a great morning, afternoon, night, wherever you are. Later, folks. You guys going to say bye? Bye. <laughs>